could feel that. <laughs> I've got one oh. finger. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I can actually feel that. <laughs> right. There we go. Right. right. I can feel that. <laughs> wow. Well, we've got one person watching. Hello, one person. Hope you're well. Um, we don't know who it is, but I hope you, we're all, wherever you are, you're having a good day, night, evening, afternoon. Two people. Hello. Do you think people are starting to find us now? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's Tisha. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. Hello, Lee. Oh, Lee. <laughs> oh, how are you all? Oh, I better change that, and I because if I don't change that, it will look Oops. funny. What are you changing? My uh, no, I can't tell you, it's rude. Oh, no, I'm just gonna share. Okay, you go for that. And I will catch you on the other side, as they say. Your nuts. My nuts are what? Hi, Amy. Hi, Tisha. Hi, Lee. Hello. Hello. I know it had to come off. It was getting a bit too much. Yep, it was getting a bit too much. Hello, Amy. Hello, Lee. Oh, look. Let's have a look. We well, I do believe we're doing really well. But uh, it's how you lot are doing. You know, are you all having a great night? A great um... baby face again. <laughs> oh yes. Oh, it looks so bum faced. Bum, baby bum, <laughs> as smooth as a baby's bottom, as they say. I'm, I'm going to ask that question. Has she actually had the baby yet? Probably by this weekend, I'd say. Right, yeah. Because, as you know, I wasn't on the last one, so I don't. I had to. I've got to catch up with uh, everything. Oh. Hi, sunny skies. We're good. I hope you're well. Hi, Andrea. <laughs> Andrea's asking you, how was the pole dancing, Paul? I know. I was, I was drinking water. I couldn't answer at the time. I do apologise. <laughs> you probably nearly choked. <laughs> no, I did, actually. I thought, what pole dancing are we talking about? Well, <laughs> we, know what, we know what you've been up to. Look, I'm, I tried not to, but it was, you know, I couldn't help it. Been sleepwalking and all. Yeah. Woohoo. <laughs> yes. Hope you're well. Sunny. Okay, every time I sit and hear that name, I, I just want to sing that. Sunny. Do, 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 do. Yes, by um, Brony M. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, mm, yeah, it was, it was okay, Andrea. The pole dancing, you know, I got to keep fit somehow. You know, yeah, that's his hobby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, hello, Mel. Oh, yeah, you sing it, Paul. <laughs> I, I, well, I would, but my voice isn't in a very good um, condition at the moment. You know. Or I would. You got a you got a small rendition <laughs> of, uh, but can you sing it? That's the thing. Can you all sing sing that song? Yeah, Sorry. sing it, Paul. Hi, no. Mel. How are you? No, but the thing is, if I start singing, that I, I start to get tired, and I don't. My readings are not as good as they should be. You know, and I've got that song running through my head then. <laughs> 
It's just annoying. I guys want one ha ha everything. Huh. Righty ho. Hello, Susan. How are you? Hi, Susan. Yeah. Wow. I would like uh would want to read me, ha ha. Everything you said, Paul, coming true. That's good. Well, maybe we'll do another reading for you tonight, Mel. We'll see what we get. How yeah, if you get, if you get your name picked out the bowl. Yes. So um, stay on. Ah. Yeah, don't disappear if you... Don't disappear. Yeah. Because, <laughs> you know, yeah. Um, if you're meant to be here like you are now, fantastic. <clears throat> but, uh, how you know... What's the weather? What is the weather like though? Is it cold, hot? Well, it won't be hot, will it? Because because you've normally told me it's uh, about six degrees or something, or eleven degrees. Hang on. Uh, see you hello, guys. Hello, Christy. Uh, hello, Christy. We're good. How are you? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> oh dear, my eyes are a bit. Uh. <coughs> um. You guys, what what to know? Uh, you guys, what to know? Oh, yeah. we're gonna see. We're gonna see, aren't we, Mel? <laughs> so, so it's freezing there, is it, Amy? Freezing. Hi, Charmaine. Charmaine's in New Zealand. Hello. It is snowing here in New Zealand. Ooh. I'm glad it's not snowing here. It, do you know, it's actually got warmer, which is nice. <laughs> Paul, you got it correct. <laughs> Thank um, you. We just, uh, I just want to let everybody know that um, if you share our live publicly... And uh, comment with a share a badge name above your name. I'll actually place you in a draw, which we, we do quite a few during the live. And if I pull out your name, you will win a free mini reading with myself and Paul. But uh, you need to be on the live. Um, you need to be on if we call your name. Um, if you would like a guaranteed reading, I have pinned uh, the donation details in the comments below. Okay, Oak. Uh, not sure why not showing. I'll go share to more. That's groups. okay. I'll, I'll check on another page. Yep. No, that's good. Uh, oh, careful what you say. <laughs> yes, I can see Sunny. So I'm just going to put you in the drawer. Sunny. Oh, God, I've got that song seriously running through my head. <laughs> I can't Look get it out. Look what you did right to here. us, Sunny. Look what you did. Oh. <laughs> You've got us now singing that song. <laughs> what do you mean? You'll have oh, to come it's on, Sunny. It's, it's, it's me that's singing it. <laughs> yeah, no, Sunny's going to have to come on and sing it. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> What you what are you serious about, Mel? <laughs> yeah, don't worry, Sonny. I've put you in the um, in the drawer. Careful what you say. She's serious. <laughs> okay. I now I've started saying money. Yeah. Money, money. <laughs> <laughs> that works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dearie me. You know, it's it's a bit um, gloomy here, but it's still warm. I actually, you know, I've been outside and it's it's not cold. I've seen people with with jackets on. It's just so you know, it's too warm for jackets. Thank you, Lee. I'm gonna I, I'm putting Lee into the drawer as well. <clears throat> 
<coughs> Hello, Shania. Oh, Shania. Hi, Shania. Baby blue, baby blue. And Amy, thank you for sharing. I'm putting you in the drawer. Hello. Have you put me in? <laughs> what we do? So, oh, Courtney. Hello, Courtney. Um, Hi, Courtney. From Texas. Te Texas. <laughs> I said something oh, rude. Texas. 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 No baby. No baby yet. I can't sure. believe it. You must be, oh my goodness. You must be hanging out to have that baby because I, I know what I was like. <laughs> well, I bet you are exhausted. Yes. Um, Hello. God, what's it like in uh, Texas, Courtney? What's the weather like at the moment? What's your day like? Because it's, was it about seven o'clock? No, it'd be late earlier than that. It'd be about six, six, five. Thank you, Christy. I'm just putting you in the drawer. And Courtney, I'm going to put you in the drawer too. Oh, hello, Jacqueline. Hello. Hope you're well. Wow. <laughs> uh Nice. Your, your ancestors come from which woolen mill? They must be up north somewhere then, because that's most probably where all the the mill. Well, that's where all the mills come from. Normally, I I thought it was a bit early, Courtney. What we need up so early? Who's up early? Courtney. What From time is it? I'm five in the morning. Is it, she's an early bird. Yeah, yeah. Um, Jacqueline? Because Jacqueline. of my heart condition, what I was saying, I'll be hearing on Friday if I get the okay or not from the doctor. Okay, going to be very hot, even with the storms. Yeah. Yeah, because it is your summer there and it does get really warm. <laughs> great, great grandfather. Okay. Hey, Sarah. Yep. I've got out of your shed, as you can see. Yes, I told him, Sarah. <laughs> Hi, Susan. <laughs> Thank you, Susan. I'm just putting you in. Erin Borough. Okay. Uh, the temp hasn't changed 24 hours. Are you on degrees? Wow. I think. Can't sleep. Kids were restless. On um, storms. I had a pretty hectic night. Didn't sleep. Wow. 81 degrees. Yeah, what, don't fall asleep on us. Sorry. I was just about to say, don't fall asleep on us, Courtney. <laughs> Your ancestors are woolen mills. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I know what she means. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but, dear, Shania. Hmm. Yeah, but it's... Uh, wow. No, but it's nice. I'm restless. We want a baby. <laughs> Says Lee. Yeah. Oh... Do you know, you'll all be ecstatic when that happens. Yeah. it's It'll be well worth waiting for. <clears throat> yep. Sarah, it's like winning the lottery. Sarah, did you buy any of those bags? <laughs> did you I buy didn't. any, Sarah? <laughs> 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 I saw them. <laughs> <laughs> oh right! Oh, are you saying about Sarah there? 
Yeah. Sarah Martin, I was asking if she bought any of those bags. <laughs> yeah, wouldn't that be wouldn't that be strange, eh? We she suddenly has the baby on here. Oh, imagine that. Yeah. First, yay, our first baby <laughs> on here. <laughs> Uh, no. You didn't buy any, Sarah. Why not? They were nice. I don't know what you're talking about, but, you know. Yeah, it'll be the first. Um... <gasps> Hi, Donna. How are you? Hello, Donna. Uh, it definitely but Thank you, Donna. I'll put you in as well. To come completely back from pre-baby days. Yeah. I've got lots to sell. <laughs> she's got lots to sell yeah but what's she selling what who's yeah. selling what i don't know you've got lots to sell i want to know i want to see <laughs> i'm really hoping she comes on on her own before next week yeah i hope so yeah uh hello diana good morning beautiful people yep yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yes, meat. <laughs> oh, <laughs> dearie me. God. No, but oh, I, I, I never got to experience a show on Monday, on Monday, on Sunday, because it was Monday yesterday. And it seemed like it went well. And, uh, you know, I, I found out that I was, uh, I was sleepwalking. Yeah, wasn't I, Silvana? Yes. <laughs> oh, hello, Courtney. Both of the boys were... Yeah. <gasps> what did Courtney say? Both her boys... Oh, were they? Sure okay. That was super exciting. Yeah. Oh. Uh... Oh, I'm pole dancing. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Diana. I didn't you notice she was on? No, I didn't know that she was on. What? I, I didn't well, see her. I'm I sorry. Did say, I, did, I did say, hello, Diana. So <laughs> what Diana's saying is um, dangerous. Yes, oh, Courtney, Paul was sleepwalking in his Where's Wally T-shirt. <laughs> so that he was sleepwalking in his Where's Wally t-shirt. We asked people in the UK to keep an eye out because it was in the middle of the night and he would have been walking in the street. And Sarah Martin graciously said that she was going to shut her curtains. <laughs> she was going to shut her curtains, but then she locked him in the shed. So Do you know, I I I, I did like Sarah once. <laughs> she just she just was gonna ignore me. That's not that's not nice. <laughs> yeah, uh, no, yeah. No. Sarah Martin's my sister. <laughs> yeah, you need to tell her then. She should have let me in and used the nah, bed. She's my sister. <laughs> We're partners in crime. <laughs> 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 Is he saying arg? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh. Courtney, um, earlier this year, he went sleepwalking and he knocked over a pole um, near where he lives and the pole actually had the cables and it was it six homes that lost their electricity? But eight. Six was it eight? Hmm. They lost the electricity. And I how long was it? It was nearly two weeks until they were able to fix that. Yep. Yep. Two weeks. They knew it was me and all I was doing was sleepwalking. And they just thought, nah, let's just leave it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So uh, I guess yeah. Paul would wear Wally while I'm sleepwalking. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> 
No, it's, it, it is. It's dangerous because, you know, I live on a really busy road. One, one car at least every other hour. <laughs> Depending. Because they use, they use my road as, I don't know if you've heard this expression before, as a rat run. You mean like a thoroughfare? A what? Is it a Rat thoroughfare? A <laughs> oh. Oh, no, that's a thoroughbred. No, a rat run is a, a basically a, a shortcut. Oh, right. Yeah, a thoroughfare. Yeah, we call it a rat run. Yeah, it's called thoroughfare. No, but I'm just saying, we call it a rat run. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I agree you call it a thoroughfare. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> wow. Do you know what could bring on sleepwalking? <laughs> I think you, <laughs> why do you think you were sleepwalking, Paul? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Stress or something. Well, both, I think. <laughs> uh, See? Susan knows what a rat run is. A thoroughfare? Yeah. No. A rat run. Yes, yeah, Susan, you're right. It's a thoroughfare sounds better and nicer. No, a rat run. You you come from this country, it's a rat run. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Courtney said you must be the Hulk in your sleep, you know, because of the electric poles are heavy. Yeah, I don't know where he got you know how you sort of get that adrenaline? I think that must be what came over him and he just pulled like knocked it over <laughs> <laughs> did you see what diana said i'm just read it <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness diana oh my goodness that's hilarious that's so hilarious <laughs> well i don't do that <laughs> oh, I wonder. I wonder. <laughs> but it, isn't it strange that I walk out, walk out, and I actually take my key with me and lock the door? <laughs> <laughs> strange, isn't it? <laughs> oh, that's so funny. <laughs> and Diana said her son always laughs in his sleep. Oh, and he, her daughter talks. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Can you imagine someone laughing in their sleep? That would be so cute. Hello, Kate. <laughs> oh, I have experienced sleep walking and I've got to consider the mo that movie, The Mask, and I'm thankful I never got myself into trouble. <laughs> Stay You're safe. You get woken up with a bonk on your head. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's just someone hitting me. Oh, hi, Kate. Is it Kate Marg or Kate? <laughs> oh. I've, got, I've got to consider that movie, The Mask. Mm. Ah. Thankful. <laughs> oh, that's, that's funny. That is funny. But, it, you know, you talk about a subject, you know, that you wouldn't normally talk about, and you see how many other people actually do it. You know, it's one of them things, isn't it? <clears throat> you know, um, as, um, you know, what was said earlier, you know, people mainly do it because they're stressed or they're overtired. Um, my ex used to walk in the bathroom. Oh, it's Kate. Across and pee Kate, in the bath. If, you sh if you share the live, <laughs> Kate... If you share our live, I'll place you in the drawer um, to get a free mini reading from both of us. <laughs> yeah. Have you seen that? No. What, what, the, what one, is? the one below the Courtney one. Okay. Let me see. Uh, what, Leo oh, hi, Leona. Yeah, Leona. My, my ex <laughs> used to walk in the bathroom, pull the shower curtains across. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, dear. <laughs> I'm glad he's your ex now, Leona. Mm. 
before they make. Just imagine in the morning if you went to go and have a bath or something, because some people have their shower in the bath, you know, in the tub, and you, you'd step in it. Can you imagine that? <laughs> that is hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I think they made it to the bathroom but missed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, see that one with Sarah? Apparently you can have a whole conversation with me while I'm sleeping. <laughs> oh, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Sarah. <laughs> I'd love to hear what you say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's try it. Oh, Kate, Kate the li live is this show that we're doing. So if you if you you'll see while you're watching us, there's a share button, and um, you you share it to like a, other groups you might be in that you can share a video to or your own page. Mm -hmm. Publicly. Publicly, yeah. You'll <laughs> see some people have got um, oh, Donna. I didn't write your name. Oh. Put Donna in. You'll know. see some people have got. <laughs> um, the word chair above their name. So, <laughs> oh no, I've got to have a look at what you're laughing at. <laughs> oh dear, my word. <laughs> uh, hang on, what am I missing? Which one? Uh, Donna. My. De daughter has definitely gone toilet on the floor as well. It might because she thought it was a toilet. <gasps> oh my goodness. And then I woke my ex husband up to inform him there was a man in our room. However, I was dead asleep. <laughs> he didn't see it. <laughs> he turned on the lights. He didn't see anyone. My husband said I had my eyes open and sat up and pointed to the corner of the room. <laughs> And then they backed out. <laughs> I'm not surprised that he didn't, couldn't go back to sleep. I wouldn't be able to sleep either. <laughs> he would have probably been looking in that corner all the time. <laughs> oh, Imagine I if, he, if he could feel the covers being pulled off. <laughs> oh, okay. oh that's so funny. <coughs> yeah, yeah. But look at Gianna. I busted my ex many times talking to him while I, he slept. <laughs> oh. oh, no. While sleeping. Oh. That is so funny. That is really, really funny. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that's definitely wake, woken my uh, jaw bones up with a laughter. Yeah, they're all funny. So I'm going to actually pull out a name to do a, a reading. We huh. actually, just so everyone knows, we actually do many, a lot of these. We pull uh, a lot of draws out. So if I don't call your name out, you still have a chance because um, we just do one after the other like that. Um, so Let, let's, let's see who or whom. Yes. All let's right, see. so yeah. let's see who's going to have the first one. Let's see. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> oh, that was oh. so funny. <laughs> I can't get over that. <laughs> <laughs> Mel. Mel. Are you there, Mel? Wow. <laughs> Mel. Hello, Mel. Melanie. Hello. Hello. Wow. Well, ow. Caught up. I laughed too much. I pulled my muscles in my back. <laughs> <laughs> what have you been? You've been doing too much pole dancing. I think so. Oh, I also violently asked my boyfriend if he, all right, <laughs> if he was wearing a dress while asleep. Told him he wasn't fooling anyone in the house. If he was wearing a dress while asleep, told him he wasn't. Trying to seduce cheeseburgers. 
<laughs> oh, what the heck? I then he's yelling. Oh, God, I swear he swears. He couldn't make it out of it. That's my phone. Wow. <laughs> Crazy happenings in there. Lol. <laughs> Mel, are you still on? My brother was staying with us and shared a room. There you go, best. Had a few. Uh -huh. uh, yeah. <gasps> he was moaning it. <laughs> That's really funny, Sarah. That is hilarious. <laughs> Oh, dear. I have no idea what I was dreaming about. Thanks for the laughs, guys. <laughs> ah, she commented before. Oh, dear me. It, oh, I've just got to do something very quickly. Yes. I knew there was something I forgot to do. He's probably gone to the toilet. I bet she's gone to the toilet. All this talk about people wetting, wetting their pants, um, all the, this talk about people wetting their pants, it's... Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she did. Oh, okay. Hang on a minute. Where are we? Oh, um, I thought I saw her a second ago. He, need, yeah. Yeah, Diana, he needs to pee. <laughs> Who, me? Yeah. No, I there forgot. she to... is. Mel? No, I forgot to turn on me doodah. What? Mel? Uh, I called out your name. Would you like a, a mini reading? Yeah. Come on. You're going to your... come on? Get your bum in gear. And yeah, get, get your on, bum on... in gear. <laughs> get, on, get on here with us. Can you can you send me your email address on Messenger, please, and I'll email you the link. <laughs> oh, don't go, Kate. Do you? Oh, okay. Well, if you like this page, um, you'll get notified when we go live next. Because I've, I've put your name in the. I actually even put your name in the draw too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, but no, thank you, thank you for joining us. You know, yeah, thank, thank um, you, Kate. Come back anytime. Sorry. No, I'm just, I'm, no, I'm, just I'm not letting to... you talk, am I? Sorry. Nah. Nah. You're getting too comfortable. No, I'm joking. No, it's like me. Sometimes I, I over. Your phone playing up. You dropped it. Okay. Do you, does that mean you just want it through the comments? Okay. I think she just wants it through the comments. Yeah. Okay. All right. We, we were looking forward to seeing your. Yeah. Face on screen. And I think everyone else was too. Everyone um, wanted to meet you, Mel. What is a doda? What oh. is a doda and how do you turn it on? What is a doda? It sounds rude. What is a doda? Hello, Rita. Hi, Rita. How are you? <laughs> Hello. Oh, she probably means doda. <laughs> I think you know that when as well. people call things a doodah, a doodad. <laughs> a doodah. <laughs> oh, God, it didn't register. <laughs> we must be tired. <laughs> like like a thing, a magic. Yeah. What's a magic? <laughs> what? What's a magic? Uh, I think that's a thing. I'm learning a thing all these new terms. That's a oh, thing with jig. Oh, a thingamajig. Okay. Oh, that's the reader. I'm glad that you're good. Oh, <laughs> God. What are you laughing at? Uh, you were know, asking what a magic was. Yeah. <laughs> that's what you the wrote. Front. It's this thing of me at the front. <laughs> oh, dear. I think she is like referring to... Like a thingamajig. <laughs> I do, Dad. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Uh, tomato, tomato, tomato. Tomato, tomato. Oh, tomato. Okay. No, that's tomato. To, yeah. Tomato, tomato. Tomato. That's all right, Mel. You're welcome. Um, where do my, whatchamacallit? 
Diana said, what you call it? Yeah, what you call it? What are, uh, Rita's asking what you're on, Paul. What are you on, what? Paul? Well, I'm, I'm on a chair. Um, but uh, no, um, oh, someone's echoing. I think it might be me, actually. Are you, what? But I, I don't know. I haven't touched anything. I haven't done anything different. Haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm still on. No, can't hear me. Can't. Oh, no, we've we've done that. It's gone all quiet now. What's gone quiet? It must Maybe it's at your end. The voices should wait. What? <laughs> I, oh. Hang on. I'm from the southwest. Talk a little funny. Sorry. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, but yeah, I do. I do. I must say that quite a lot, though, don't I? About doodars, and if I can't remember what it's called, it's a doodah or a thingy jig or a uh, you know um, loads of other little wordings. But uh, you know, well, I'm actually looking forward to doing this. Well, I ain't, I ain't done a reading since Saturday, so not, you know, I've had things to to do. But, uh, yeah, here England are playing tonight, everyone. Come on, the boys. We're playing Germany. Newfoundland. Wow. <laughs> wow. I know someone who was born there. Hmm. Yes. Well, do you think there'll be good ones today, Johanna? Huh? Do you think there'll be a good one? I don't know. I've got some serious cards out here. Yeah, look, even, even Lee saying, go live, Mel, go live. <laughs> yeah. Well, she said, she said her phone's knackered. Her phone's not working. She says she threw it on the floor. So I don't know how how she can... If you don't live that far away, you'll have to go and, say, uh, you know, bring her on to yours. And you come on live then. That'd be fun. Get the whole family on. <laughs> Oh, she's in the bath. Who's it? Sarah, are you in the bath again? No, supposedly. Who's in the bath? Who's Ma in the bath? Uh, Mel. Supposedly. Broken glass, just working. Yeah, you need to take it to oh, my I've shop. done that before. It's expensive. Sometimes you're better off just getting a new phone. Hmm. Um, and then, like, you know, it all depends if they, if they um, fix it properly. Well, all it is is not the top screen because that's all it is. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, all they do is just put a new screen on and Bob's your auntie. Yeah, I had that, but um, after a period of time, it was starting to come off again. The actual screen. I don't know if you put it on properly. It's hard to understand us sometimes. No, I think um, Canadians. I understand you. My geography teacher was Canadian, and he always called me Sylvana. Sylvana, get out of the classroom. Because <laughs> I, I used to muck around a lot. <laughs> so you, just, you, don't you come out. back. <laughs> yeah, you sat outside a lot then. Pardon? You sat outside a lot then. Yeah, well, I used to sneak back in, but he used to call me Sylvana. Well, could he not see you when you came back in? No. What, what did you oh, hide? Oh, well, if back? he did, if, if he did, he didn't say anything. So, no. he, well, you he saved him a job going outside the classroom and going, Oi, get your bum back in there. Yeah. 
Yeah. All right. I'm actually ready to do Mel's reading. Right. Okay. Hang on. Yeah, I've got my screen fixed and the guy completely butchered my phone. He swapped my phone battery and ruined my phone, even though I just asked for my screen fixed. Yeah, well, I'm quite lucky. My mate live, works, he's got his shop down the road about five minutes from my house. Um, and he fixes phones every single day. And then he gives you 12 months guarantee and all, all that. Um, yeah, it's quite good. It's quite good. But Mel's ready. She's, yes, I'm ready to do Mel's reading. She's laying there in the soapy suds. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, um, sorry. Yeah. Mel, what I'm getting for you, right, you'll see here there's an angel. Um, on one side there's the kangaroo, a large kangaroo, and the other side is like a little bird. Um, this, for me, is like it's signifying... Um, like a there's like an unbalance of rhythm with yourself and the universe um i feel that there's too much of one side and not enough of another side so there, there's an imbalance um now what i i, I feel is that um that your lifestyle um i'm being guided to advise you on your lifestyle um to take heed and take notice of like getting enough sleep um like eating the right foods um if you have like any um you know like making sure you get a lot of exercise not eating the wrong stuff or drinking the wrong stuff that i'm getting that that's kind of out of balance for you um and also like in your own rhythm in your energy there, there seems to be a, an unbalance like there's more to one side. It's not all well-rounded. Um, and this, when I say this, it's more like um, unrounded as in unconditional love. So I'm, I'm feeling that, you know, um, it, it's like at the moment that there's no love as um, for yourself. Um, you know, it, it's we all put up a front, we all, like even myself, I'm not feeling it and I'll put up a positive front and I feel that you may do that as well, but deep down there, there's something um, that is unbalanced within your heart um, and I feel that um, you'll find that once you can sort through that, you will actually feel different about other people around you um, and I, I feel that um, this imbalance in your self-love would be causing you having disharmony with those around you um and, and this is also the the out of rhythm that you're having at the moment in you're not in line with the universe um i i just find here I, i've pulled I, i'm going to show you this because i don't want you to think why she's saying this i'm not sure are you the type of person that feels like they they control someone or I'm actually getting like um actually looking at that now with these other ones it's more like trying to control I feel like like you're um you're not letting things flow naturally it's like um a controlled um like sabotaging a relationship by using a controlled means perhaps of getting um, information where instead of like um, um, like letting things go through naturally. And I feel that this stems from the, um, the blockage that you have at the moment with self-love. Um, and, and I feel this is something you could actually remedy with um, looking after yourself it, with your lifestyle, um, but also in um, some perhaps solitude. But solitude, I mean, like in relaxation, soothing music, um, and just perhaps if there's any particular thing that you're overdoing, perhaps like just let go of things and, and um, let things... Um, 
let your inner self guide you, but I, I feel that you're out of balance for that. So you do need to um, balance yourself with your your lifestyle um, because I, I do feel that that our condition, like you, the self love, is not there at the moment, and I feel that that is um, affecting your relationships um, with people around you. Now I um, I've pulled out these really nice cards here. Um, like there's a, a jack in the box coming out of his box. And um, this one as well, like this is all about not being afraid to shine and um, coming out of your box and, um, you know, expanding your horizons. But you need to be careful how you do that. Now, I've called out this, angel, uh, this fairy here, and, and this is all about, um, you know, you have to be careful what you wish for because sometimes um, it might not be what's right for you and you can manifest the wrong things. Uh, you can put out the wrong intentions, manifest the wrong things, and sometimes you'll find that it's too late to turn it back. Um, so... That's all I get for you, but we'll see what Paul can get for you, and um, we'll, we'll um, I'll wait to hear from you to see if that resonated. Okay, righty ho. Um, let me uh, see what I can get for you then, Mal. Um, you know, as I said before um, to you. You know, you get what you need, not what you want. So whatever comes out will be, um, you know, be relevant to yourself. Okay. So let's let's do this. Okay. Okay. Right. Wow. Okay, Mel. What I'm getting with you is. It, it's like it's like you've got it's like you've got that it's like a tension inside you and it's like you're ready to burst okay it's like you're ready to to burst out and you just want to start and you want to start giving out as much as you can okay but you've got to be careful some of this might sound similar, <laughs> by the way. Um, you've got to, you've got to control your feelings for certain things. Okay, you have to be um, keeping things under wrap more. You have to make sure that what you're doing is right for you okay it's not, i'm not saying you shouldn't stop i'm saying that you should control it control it more okay and understand it more and <clears throat> maybe go somewhere and see you know get um appreciate it more yeah appreciate everything that goes on in your life and journey that you're on at this moment okay you will find that there, there will be some big changes okay but those changes are going to you know be for um keeping you on the straight and narrow okay they're not to move they're to move you on but they're, they're to cut to put your focus back in into some sort of order okay you're not you know you're not a person who needs to be on show all the time okay you don't need to be on show every five minutes okay you're you're a, you're a lovely lady you know but you need to make sure that you you're focused on what you're doing okay don't give up on on yourself but also there's things around you that that need to be sorted uh but don't go gung-ho on these things because um 
if you do then more thing more problems will occur okay and then you you you'll just find life going downhill quickly okay you've got to understand that in life we have to do certain things to make people um more appreciative but also we have to make sure that those people are not unhappy with us okay because it, it, it's like at the moment i just get it's like fisticuffs <laughs> i don't know why it just feels like fisticuffs with what i'm yeah but it, this some this what i'm getting it, it's something to do with the past as well because the past uh seems to run your life also okay but you've got to make sure that that past doesn't run your life you've got to make sure that you're starting to build new bricks uh new bricks new new um new parts of your journey and those parts of the journey will be amazing but you you've got to make sure that you're putting the jigsaw pieces in the right places because it just seems like they're all over the place okay you're a smart lady so don't don't put yourself down okay um because you are smart but sometimes you try and take things too far too quick and i think i said this earlier you need to understand things before you move them on now because if you keep pushing and pushing and pushing you the bubble will burst and it'll just you know like balloons do you'll just suddenly start to go somewhere where you don't want to okay and and you'll start to struggle and those struggles will will continue okay um and you you like i say you're a smart lady and you don't you know you know where the problems are you've just got to put them all in to the right order okay you've got to make sure that where you're heading and where the people that are coming into your life um are helping you make make sure that you don't push people away because there are people out there that are guiding you um into the right locations but it's, it's like it's my life i'm going to do what i like yeah but sometimes you might need a an extra voice or voices to just tell you what you should be doing you know it's your choice all the time but they 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 can oh what's the word they they can encourage you into the you know down a good path instead of all over the path all over the place yeah you've got to go for this uh, go for it in certain aspects um i do believe that certain aspects of like your business and uh business aspects are you know need change not changing but tweaking a little bit just to just so that you can get a, a, a few more customers okay and i think you know that will uh help you but it will help a few others around you too okay because you need to start to progress and you know you need to progress your journey your journey is amazing as it is but you need to tweak things and not like i said a minute ago don't don't overdo things you've got a uh, this you know you push too hard and you won't won't go nowhere you've got to start to listen okay and just take heed of the words from it doesn't matter who if they're giving you the correct wording then you take it on board but i'm i am getting that um from the from the spirit world also that they're saying calm yourself down because you're taking this part of your journey too quick 
okay, you will find that no one will listen because you're not giving the right information. You're not taking your time to listen to yourself. You're not taking the time to do anything that is supposed to be done. Okay. But uh, I'm also getting that it feels like there's, there's someone in, uh, that stands beside you. Uh, and it feels like that. So, and they're really close to you, you know, and they're very, and it just feels like someone's trying to push them away all the time. And that person's not going to be in a very good state of mind if you, if you push them away. Okay. You've got to make sure that, you know, that they're in a good frame of mind, like yourself, you know, you've got to bring yourself, it's like you're, it's like you've taken yourself away from the real you and brought a new you in, which isn't the real you. Okay. And that, and it's, it's, people are not recognizing you. Okay. So you've got to take that one that you've brought in and bring back the old one because the old, the old you is better than the one you are the, the one you are at the moment okay but don't give up on life don't give up on your journeys because you you've still got so much to learn but you've got to learn it you can't just go yeah okay I'll do this and I'll do this yeah if you miss out things you're never going to get anywhere and I know I keep repeating it and repeating it but it, it, it's like you need to give yourself a kick up the bum sometimes just to say, I'm going the wrong direction. I'm not doing this correctly. Okay. And I feel that's what you need to be doing. Okay. But I'm going to leave that one with you. And I hope that resonated with yourself, uh, Mel. And uh, just keep going. And, and, I know, and I know you can turn it around because, like I said earlier, You've got that. You've got the smarts inside you to do it. Okay. So you keep going and let us know. Okay. But you take care. Yeah. <clears throat> and thank you. Yeah. Um, Kate is actually cooking something really nice. She's making curry and rice. <laughs> mm. Well, I hope that that helps you, Mel. I hope so. I yeah. hope so. Because, like I say, the, we, you know, the words come out, and we can't. Well, we could stop the words, but you know, um, it just felt right to say say those words. So, but you, like I said, keep going. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, Mel. Yep. Just, just don't say it now, and then, then five minutes down the road say oh you know and, and start forgetting about listening to people okay you've got to you've got to make make it one of your things in life now you've got to start to listen to other people but also yourself okay so brilliant okay okay um, I just want to let um, the newer people that have come on, um, just let them know that if you share our live, I will place you in a draw, which we draw throughout the, the live. And if your name gets called out, you will win a free mini reading with myself and Paul. Um, you do need to be on the live uh, to claim it. Um, but if you'd like a guaranteed mini reading, 
a donation would do that for you. And I've pinned the details for that um, in the pinned comments below. Uh, I'm just, I'm about to pull out another drawer, but just before I do that, um, I was going to ask if anyone would like an affirmation card. Would anyone like me to pull out uh, an affirmation card for them? They're just small cards. <laughs> tiny, 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 tiny cards. cards. <laughs> Tiny, tiny cats. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Courtney says, Courtney, what is that? I'll, I'll pull one out for you, Courtney, and you'll know what um, what what it is. Thank you, Lee. Yeah, thank you, Lee. Yeah. All right. So, Courtney, this one's for you. Oh, all right. Right. Okay. All right. So, Courtney, I'll pull this one out for you. Let go of yesterday as what you do right now is more important. Um, okay. So, Susan. Yeah, Susan. Susan, yep. Yeah. So, Susan. I pulled this one out for Susan. Yep. Fragrant are the flowers that bloom when you smile and let go. Okay. Um, I don't Susan. know what that means with... Diana, but I'm assuming she wants one. I think she wants one, yeah. All right, yeah. so Diana, I've pulled this one out for you. So meditate to dispel all fears and become a beautiful, enchantingly magnetic person. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Um, Mel, I'm assuming she wants one. Mel, Even yeah. though she's just started breathing, but. Okay, Mel, I've got this here for you. Your glass is always refillable. Flow like water instead of holding on to perceptions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jacqueline. Jacqueline? Yep. Okay. Jacqueline, where is she? Yeah. Oh, there, there, yep. All right, so Jacqueline pulled this one out. Don't compare yourself to others. Smile and be content with your natural beauty. Oh, that's a good word. Uh, Lee. Uh, Lee, yeah. Yep. So I pulled this one out for Lee. Overcome the desire to tame your wildness. Teach your mind to follow your heart. Mm. And Rita. And so one, yeah, Rita. Okay. Rita. Yep. Okay. All right. So, Rita, this one's yours. Find a place of quiet solitude and listen to the goddess of the moon. Is she calling for more love? Wow. Ooh. Okay, so I think. Oh, got a chin leg. Yeah, you're welcome, Diana. Yeah, no, I, I don't do the affirmation cards, so I don't know. They're just like mini sayings, aren't they? Which are quite uh, quite good. Okay. But uh, yes, um, no, but they are quite interesting. You know, I, like I say, um, it's something I don't do. So I, I, I've never. Well, you did me one before, didn't you? On. Um, would Saturday. You, would you like me to do another one for you, Paul? Is it going to tell me I'm sleepwalking again? I don't know. It might. Okay. Go on, then. You give me one. So here's yours. Play, pay close attention to your patterns and let go of those that are merely reactions to life. I'll have to read that one again. Oh. What's that again? I'll hold it out and I'll show you later. Okie dokie. You okay. show me later. I'll show. <laughs> well, <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> no, the card, the card. Oh, you're welcome, Rita and Jacqueline. You're all welcome. Um, the card I was on about. But uh, no, thank you. Wow. Um, oh, wow. I'm going to pull out another person. 
are you what are you laughing at oh look i always laugh you know me <laughs> uh, uh, before I pull out um, someone else's name, I'm just checking to see if there's any others for me to add into the draw. I'm just having a quick look to see who shared. Righty ho. <gasps> wow. Okay. Fingers crossed. Everybody's oh, got their. <laughs> Thank you, Kate. Play close attention to Courtney's your Courtney's got her fingers yeah. crossed. <laughs> yeah, play. Yeah, Diana says play close attention. <laughs> to <laughs> Diana! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I really like that. Oh, thank you so much, Kate. That's lovely. <laughs> there you go. Yep, thank you. Thank you. All right. Um, oh, you're hilarious. And now I know where your son gets it from, Diana. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank All you. Right. Okay, so I'm going to pull out <laughs> another name. Ooh, is it me? Is it me? You want me to do you a reading? <laughs> oh. All right. <laughs> Okay. I'm just hoping whoever this is comes on live with us. Oh, yes. It'll be nice if you come on live, whoever I and pull it out. It doesn't matter if your hair's out of place or you've put, got a mud pack on. We don't doesn't care. <gasps> Dana. Are you there, Dana? Hello, Dana. Dana. Hello. Can you hear that echo? Dana! No. Dana! No. Oh, my God. <laughs> Earpieces. <laughs> <laughs> do, do, do you feel like I've made you go deaf? Pardon? Do you... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can make you feel dizzy. Oh, you most probably could. Oh, dear, yeah. Mm. Are you dizzy yet? No, not yet. Okay. We'll give Dana another 30 seconds. Do, 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 do. Oh, I'm watching it on the screen and it's. I'm going to throw up in a minute. It's making me dizzy. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did it. I didn't. Oh, dear. It made me feel dizzy. Dana. Go on then. Do, 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 do. Right. Well, we give everyone 30 seconds, 30 seconds to a minute. And if okay, you're not in... up there, so I'm going to pull out someone else's name. Well, it's somebody else's chance to Ooh. be picked out of the ball. Who's it going to be? Show, it? Who's it going to be? <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Courtney. <laughs> We're just, we're just here Ooh. to lift everybody's energies. I don't we're, know if this here. person is still on. Oh, no. Um, Billy Bob. Susan O'Curry Nesta. Susan! <laughs> O'Curry Nesta? Yeah, yeah, look. Susan O'Curry Nesta, are you on? <laughs> oh, dear. I thought it was Kate making the curry. Yesterday morning. Hello, Sue. <gasps> She's there. She's on. <laughs> Susan. <laughs> wow. And got a scratch down your face. Wow. Some burner puppies. My my uh might have one of them. They're massive things. But they're they're good in winter. Are they the they're... ones that have that little thing here? Yeah. What yeah. do they put in there? Whiskey. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or that, whatever. Right. But he he had one. And in winter, when it was really cold, if yeah. it sat on you, it was like a heater all oh, in that's one. Cute. That's cute. But the thing is, it'd crush your feet because it'd be okay. that heavy. Yeah. Yeah, Kate, 
you made me hungry when you told me what you were cooking. I actually do feel oh, hungry. Sherry, if I could. <laughs> yeah, because she's making curry and rice. Okay. What sort of curry? Now, Susan, you have a choice. Would you like to come on on camera with us on the live? And to do that, you don't need a login or anything. Just send me your email address and I'll send you um, an invite. Come on, praying that you'll come on live. Yeah, so <laughs> when you click, when you go to, all, all you have to do is turn off your Facebook Go to your emails and click on the link that's in the email that I send you. Yes. When, as you're going through, make sure that you enable your camera and your mic. When you come through here, um, if you choose that option, um, it's you actually get better value um, for your reading because um, there's that interaction. But if mm -hmm. you don't want to do that, it's okay. We can do your reading through the comments. Yeah. Um, you've seen that from Deanna. She's going live today, making oh, pulled pork. Pulled pork. Oh, enchiladas. Oh. Okay. Enchiladas. Yum, 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 yum. So, Susan, is that okay that you want to come on the live? Yes. Yes. She does? Yes. Oh, great. Fantastic. Now, do you, can you please send me your email address to on Messenger to this page so I can email you the invite and then turn off your Facebook? Uh, otherwise, it won't work. So turn off your Facebook and then go to your emails and follow that. Woohoo! Oh, there's a pigeon. I'll wait to receive her email address. There's a pigeon just turned up in my garden. <laughs> yeah, because it heard that Diana's making um, pulled pork enchiladas. I know they actually actually live in my next door neighbour's, just above his back door. Oh, really? Yeah. No, they've got a nest there, and they come back every year. Oh, nice. No, it's all right because they, yeah, it's like a a wake up call during the day. Oh, hi. Can I have a reading? And thank you. Okay. Thank you, Susan. I'm just copying your email address and um, I'm about to send you. Well, right. Um, if you'd like to put your, you know, uh, share our page, Julie, uh, or our live, sorry, uh, then, then you'll get put into the draw. And I, I do believe you've been on before anyway, so I think you know, sort of know how it works. Um, I thought she said she's got cannabis then. I read that wrong. You're nuts. I'm, I'm Deanna. I read it wrong. You're nuts. <laughs> oh, it's got cardinals and blue jays nesting in. Yeah, we've got uh, blackbirds and little diddly birds. And, and it's nice because they they sing you to sleep at night. Yeah, they actually sing you to sleep at night. Um, yeah. Susan, I've sent the email to you. <clears throat> oh, is she on her way yet? I have, but I haven't had a reading yet. That's okay, Julie. If you share the live, I can place you in the draw, or if you'd like a guaranteed reading. Um, I have placed the donation details um, in the pinned comment. That will guarantee you a reading. Um, I just. She has chickadees. I've never heard of chickadees. Maybe she means chickpeas. No, she says chickadees. They're birds. They're birdies. Little birdies. The birdies. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, chickadees. Yes. Chickadees. Nice. Yeah, but we've got, I've just, because I've got like a, uh, like a pond, not a pond, it's like somewhere where they can drink, because it's not a natural rainwater that's gone into this container. 
and uh, the little all the birds love it because my next door neighbour he, he feeds them and they come for my come to mine for a drink, so they're having a good night out. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Is she coming? No, not yet. <gasps> not yet. Not, not yet. yet. Not yet. Yeah, but um. Oh yeah. What, did you have something nice for tea? <laughs> Her mum calls chickadee. <laughs> Your mum calls you chickadee, chickadee dee, <laughs> chickadee dee. <coughs> Did you have a nice tea? Dinner? That reminds me of that song, chicka boom, chicka boom. Don't you just love it? You know that song? All right. Oops. Must just be a nice rallying thing. <laughs> no, no. I'll, I'll play it for you later. <laughs> it's actually nice. I like it. I'm looking forward to all these things you're going to show me. <laughs> no, but I'll, I'll ask for a third time. Did you have a nice dinner? 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 Yeah. Are you talking to me? Yeah. Well, I can talk to everybody. Did everybody yes. have a nice dinner and a nice tea? What did you have? Did you have something real? Oh, she's in. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Can you Hi. hear me? Hi, Susan. <laughs> okay. Nice. How are you? I don't know, but we've only got half a face. I know, I can't get my mic. <laughs> okay, I'm here. No, okay, this is not working. For me. Oh, yes, I'm here. Yeah, no, all right, I'm going to do it like that to get all of it. <laughs> I'm not going to move. I won't move. Okay, go on. That's all right. Sit there. <laughs> okay. There you go. So how are you then, Susan? I'm not too bad. This is really affecting my vertical here. <laughs> I'll stop. I'll stop. Yeah. <laughs> trying, to make, <laughs> trying to make you all sick. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, that, dear. That, that won't help. <laughs> I did it before, and then I looked at another screen, and it did. It made me feel sick. <laughs> I was just going, woo, all over. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, so, so. So you, you're going to pull the cards, yes? Um, yeah. Okay. Oh, what's that noise? I don't know. If someone's phone ringing. Well, it's definitely not me because I haven't got a phone. It's not me. Sounds like someone's phone ringing. Okay, that's all right. What is that coming from? That's... It is. Hang on. Yeah, it's coming from Susan. <laughs> what? I, I muted you just to check. I, I don't know. Oh, dear. Yeah. Is it on now? Yep. Yep. It just sounded like somebody. Uh... I don't know. See, I can't hear that now. Is it, is it still there? Or is it? Yeah, no, it's all right. We'll work, we'll work around it. I might mute you while we do the reading. Um, just before we start, I just want to say thank you, Julie. We've received your donation. We're just doing a reading for Susan at the moment, but we'll do a reading for you as soon as we finish this one. Thank you for that. Spot on. Thank you. Thank you. But I'm going to, I'm going to ask a question that I'm, I ask everybody. What do you think of our show? Me, is it? What you do you? Me? me? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Can I You're talk? the one on the screen. Yeah, you can talk. I, I love it. I love it. I, oh. no, honestly, honestly, especially on the days where you feel not so good. But yeah, it, it's it's great just to tune in. And I just like listening. I don't need, you know, lo I love getting a reading, but I love listening and watching. It's hilarious. It's, it's really funny. And I enjoy it as well. It's 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 really good. So, yeah, oh, brilliant. Good. We, I'm we glad, glad you're enjoying it. We try to be as natural as we can. Yeah, but that's you, you, you can see that, and it's funny. It's it's yeah, the way yeah. it should be. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I've just realised you're from Ireland. What part? I am. Well, it's the southwest, so I'm County Limerick. That's where I'm from. Okay, and I've got yeah. relatives over that way. Oh, what? Where? Well, like in Ireland, somewhere. Somewhere. I know. Okay. I know. We flew into. I can't think. Where. Um, Cork. 
Self, Shannon? Belfast. Oh, yeah, okay. That's a distance from me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. yeah, you're in Southern Ireland, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I'd love to go there because people keep saying it's a beautiful place. It is. <laughs> and so is the UK because I love parts of the UK. I, 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 my aunt used to live in Derbyshire and uh, mm -hmm. I, I, I loved, I absolutely loved it. Absolutely loved it. It's very like parts of where I was from in County Limerick, you know, mm. beautiful, beautiful. Mm. Yeah. No, but it, it is. Um, but I do find because when that, when they show um, like pictures or, or or old clips of people from your end of the country, they talk really really fast. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. No one can understand. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so so you're, you've sl you've had to slow down a lot. Um, well, yeah, I would speak fairly fast now, but I'm, <laughs> well, I have to listen as well, so I have to keep quiet, <laughs> but I would talk fairly fast. When I was younger, I was, a little, I was like that. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. So I, I'd slow down a bit. Because no, what they normally show you is two old men. I, yes. In their cloth caps. Yeah. That's it. And yeah. I wouldn't even understand them. Never mind. <laughs> I wouldn't even understand what they're saying, no matter what. Like I wouldn't understand. Um, yeah. Who are, who, who are the? Um, oh, blimey! The ones in the Olympics. Is it the the, the brothers that do the? the oh yeah. Yes, uh, um, they're from Kerry. They're from Kerry. Yeah, they're, they they row. Is the rowing bro? They row. Is that the the boys? The, they're very so. young. Yeah, yeah, they're rowing. They do rowing. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. That, they were on um, uh, Graham Norton. Yes, they're very funny. And no one could understand them. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's so funny about it. Yeah, yeah. I could understand them now a bit, but yeah, I know what you're saying. I know. I know exactly. <laughs> yeah, but it's just weird that, you know, it doesn't matter. Because, I, like I say, I, I like that place. Because we were right on the East Coast, uh, on, on, you know, on the Atlantic, yeah. basically. Yeah, and it yeah. Was, it was it was an amazing place. Right. Okay. Okay. We, okay. we only went for a birthday, and it, all it right. Was, but it was, you know, it was so windy when we got there. Because uh, is it raining there today? It's at the sun for the first time is splitting the rocks here today. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, it is beating down hot. Very nice today, but it's not usually. But we, I mean, I didn't think we were going to get any kind of summer at all, which is usual. But yes, it's what? a beautiful day out there. Well, we had, two weeks. we had two weeks and that's it. Yeah, the, really? You had two weeks? Oh, yeah. Okay. It's I've not much. Two weeks. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> now, now it's all clouded over. But it's really? getting warmer again. Okay. 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 Yeah. We, but, yeah, we had a small bit of weather, but it's, it's, we haven't really got a summer yet. You know, it's not happening this year for some reason. It's not really happening. No. So I, don't, I yeah. think we'll get an Indian summer. Oh, God. I hope so. I hope yeah. so. <laughs> Back end, of, back end of the, you know, like yeah, yeah. I think that that's what we're going to get. Okay, okay. It's going to be nice and hot. Good. <laughs> yeah, we'll all be out there in our bikinis. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll, we hope. I'll, we hope. I'll have to get mine out. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> I wanted to see her face. In your mankini. <laughs> oh, no. oh, God. No, no. Oh, no. I'd get, get that out of your head quick. I can see the colour green as well, and luminous. Anyway, okay, then we won't go there. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> Are you all ready? <laughs> yeah, all right. nice. <laughs> I'm going ready. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one who can normally drink it, but blimey, this is that's made me red. Man, <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it's, it's fairly warm in this room. I can tell you, I, I'm actually feeling the heat in this room. My god, anyway. <laughs> I didn't know where to go. I was going to go live. I, I was trying to find a room uh, <laughs> without much noise with my daughter is, with her friend. And I was trying to find a room. So I came in here uh, roasting. 
<sighs> it's hot in there, is it? Yeah, it's a small room and I'm kind of going, dear God. So I opened the window so to let some kind of air in. Yeah. <sighs> so are you are you ready yet, Joanna? Oh, I'm, yeah. I'm, re I'm almost ready anyway. Oh, sorry, you're talking <laughs> to me. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Joanna. Tip one and two. <laughs> What I'm going to do, um, once I, while I do the reading, um, when I finish, don't say anything yet um, because, and then Paul will do his and then you can give us your feedback after that. Okay. Um, all right. But I'm, I'm, well, like you do, Silvana, I'll, I'll turn my sound off so I can't, I'll, I'll just, so we can just hear you, but not me. Okay. I'm just wondering because we're getting some feedback from Susan. I don't know whether you want me to mute um and then i can unmute her but start start the reading and if you feel it's the right thing to do okay. then do i was it. just thinking for you because i know that that might um yeah yeah, yeah. all right that'll be fine uh okay but uh right all right so I think she's just about to start there susan susan yeah. right i am gonna mute you yeah, for some reason. Sorry, Susan. I'll put you back on once they're done. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, Susan, um, <laughs> what I'm getting for you is that um, you're you're being sent comfort uh, from the angels. Um, it, it's like you're going through a healing process, and um, it, it's a healing process um, just to get back to that inner peace within yourself. Um, it, it's, I, I feel like I need to tell you to focus on the stillness and have meditative moments. Um, like if you meditate or is it's good for you, um, if um, even just listening to relaxation, soothing music, or even just being in solitude um, on your own and just contemplating just, you know, letting things go through you and releasing the things that no longer serve you. Um, you'll find that by doing this um, and getting back your inner peace, um, it will bring back your vibe um, and you'll find that your life will flow easily, more easily. Um, I do feel that you are um, a little out of rhythm um, with the universe. You're just a little unbalanced. Um, but I feel that following this process um, with meditation and just focusing on yourself and having that inner peace, uh, releasing, uh, let go, whatever may be holding you down, any burdens you're feeling or any sadness, um, just let it go uh, and you'll get, you'll see here, um, I've pulled out the um, the, the, the um, inner peace card. Um, I'm also getting here that you have like an affinity with children um children um are like drawn to you you're actually very good with helping children like in a way of counseling um you're soothing to them um and i i need to well i feel like i'm being um guided to tell you to use those skills because you know you're helping children and it is what um it is part of your purpose. But what I'm also getting is um, books. I don't know, like, whether you'd be writing a book or books is something that you do or books with children. I'm getting something with books. And I feel that whatever it is that you're thinking perhaps to do or to combine this, that the time is now. Um, open the door and walk out because the time is now to do it. Uh, you'll find that um, it, it's like you're opening the door to the light and the pathway is clear. It, it's like a, a magical gateway. You'll see I've pulled out here opening that the light is behind the door there and it's actually ready for you. But I need to also tell you that... Um, Make sure that you step out and do things for yourself to not bury yourself in your work or in uh, doing too much for others. You need to make sure that you also think of yourself and take the time out for yourself. 
that's all I'm getting here. It's just a, a mini reading, but don't say, oh, you can't say anything because I've muted you. <laughs> but wait till Paul's going to do a reading for you now, and then I'll unmute you and you can give us your feedback. Yeah, you, you're muted, Paul. Yeah, <laughs> you have to unmute yourself. <laughs> I can unmute you. I can do it for you if you want. Okay. I'm ready. Right, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> right, let's see what we can get for you then, Susan. If I'm not looking at the screen, it's because I don't like seeing the mannerisms of people's faces, but... It's not because, you know, you've got a wart on the side of your face. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, uh, <laughs> right, right, here we go. Oh, I've got to calm down now. <laughs> that one tickled me. <laughs> Okay, right. The, the first thing I'll get in with yourself, uh, Susan, is someone, it feels like someone's going to be coming very close to you and it, it, it and it's going to be very fast when this happens. Yeah, it's going to be like a, a, like a new friendship, but it's going to, it's going to be like bang, bang, bang. We're, we're friends <laughs> and it's going to be amazing when it happens. OK, it's just going to be uh, one of them instant friendships. And it's just going to be something that that you've been looking for, but also this other person's been looking for. OK, and and it. <sighs> yeah, to start with, it will be just like you're walking around and you just start talking. It's like you just start talking. So look out for this. If it hasn't already happened, look out for this. It feels like, I don't know, it feels like someone's in a shopping in a shopping centre or something similar. You know, you just start talking. It's just like you've known each other for years, you know. But uh, this person is also going to help you and guide you into a new space of life. OK, this person, I do believe, is a like an arcane, like an angel that's coming to meet you. And they're going to they're going to surprise you with some words that you've wanted to hear for a very, very long time. OK, but they're like an earth angel and they're going to. Like I said, it's going to be. And amazing the energies are going to lift you that the and your energies are going to lift them also but that the energies are going to just take you to from down here up here and it's going to be it is it's going to be amazing not just for you and them it's going to be amazing for a lot of people that are around you like family members and yeah they're going to wonder why you know your because it, it feels like you you've been down a few times and it, you find it hard to come back from that being down but this is to lift you to give you that energy again to give you that fulfillment of life which you seem to have lost okay um you also will be learning a lot from like i say from this person but they'll also be taking you out into nature and that nature will will give you some um, grounding as much as um, a new lease of life. OK, you. Hmm, it, it also feels that there's a there's a person that, that stands next to you and they they actually come from the spirit world. OK. And they have always been there for you since their 
passing um, and they've wanted to come through and, and say some wonderful words to you but it's like you're not listening it's like you're just it's like they're, they're, they're literally standing there put, tugging on your top on you and saying listen to us because we've been trying to tell you we were it's like they were trying to tell you while they were alive okay it was like they were trying to tell you when they were alive these same words and now now they want to tell you in um well not in death but you know since they've passed you know it, it's why why didn't you start this before why didn't you why didn't you do this before why didn't you give yourself a chance because you you have so much to give to others you have that as we know you have that smiley face you have that wonderfulness inside you you know that so many people appreciate okay and and they're sitting there and they're going and it's like they're wagging their finger they're sitting there and they're wagging their finger and it's like come on it's your turn you know and and if you don't if you don't turn turn certain things around they are going to keep pushing you not in the sense of pushing you they're going to keep being there for you and giving you um guidance into um what you need because like i say it's like you've got light that shines through you too okay and this is another thing what i was just saying about this person already knows that you're you have a wonderfulness inside you but it sometimes goes away because it's like oh i can't do that i can't do that i can't do that but you can you you have it inside you you just need to relax you need to relax and keep in touch with yourself okay um there's so many people that are looking forward to you looking forward to you i don't know i don't know what it is but there's something that's gonna go on because uh, i get singing i i get singing um because it's like microphone and stage okay but it feels like it's in it's like in, in a small pub of some sort and it's either karaoke or you do this as a um you you or it's something you want to do or it's something you already do okay uh but you've got to keep in touch with that and don't don't quit because you have so much talent you have so much talent inside you you but there's that's a it's like a, a dog as well that sits beside you that's so um i don't know if it's from the spirit world or from from yeah you know, like um the um kind of think what the words are now but it it's like it looks like a black labrador but it it could be um something else but it whatever it was or is sat on somebody's lap for a cuddle it always sat there looking directly at the screen with you if you're on a computer it wouldn't wouldn't let you do it wouldn't let you work yeah it was always that type of thing it was it it played it played so i'm assuming this is from the spirit world okay but uh, there's also going to be some rewards for yourself because of what you've done for other people and what you've done for uh um yeah just for what you've done for other people and you know so these rewards are going to be amazing for yourself and you're you're gonna you're gonna think why do i need this award? it's like somebody's putting a medal on you 
it's like somebody's putting a medal here and just saying thank you yeah but uh i'm gonna leave that one with you i hope that resonated with yourself because that one came through and uh, wow <laughs> i can speak <laughs> wow can i talk <laughs> you can Go hear <laughs> thanks so much that was absolutely i actually got a bit teary i was trying to i was trying to yeah because you, you said something about someone on the other side is thanking me mm. i think i think i know who that person is mm. so it was, it was it was very good <laughs> because i'm gonna what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna look back at what you said later and really <laughs> listen take it on board because i have but it's mm. i'm a bit <laughs> emotional mm. actually to be honest yeah okay. but that was amazing that was amazing and from the both of you that was spot on you mentioned counseling though which is something i've always wanted to do with children things like that so that's kind of something yeah it's something I've, I've been thinking about working with students working with students working with students and i keep applying for work and it just doesn't seem to be working for me so i keep applying and then i had a sister who who was blind and I looked at her, I was always there for her. So she passed away. So wow. she was my best friend. Wow. And it's very lonely. <laughs> so yeah. No, but it's nice that she keeps in contact. Yeah. So, <laughs> okay. okay, thank you so much. But as, yeah, but as we say, you know, um, okay. you know, the, the words that you're given are what you, you're meant to have for that you know yeah some people think oh yeah but it could, we're up we're after uncle frank or somebody like that yeah it, yeah yeah, yeah it, it doesn't work like that you just get what you're given yeah and that was nice <laughs> but we yeah. oh because oh, i didn't think i didn't think i was going to stop uh, yeah i said that i said oh my god i'm 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 taking everyone's time and i said oh my god i'm oh, taking, I'm taking everyone's time i don't want to take everyone's time and i could feel that it was I think there was a, a few people that wanted to speak, maybe on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> so, because I speak to everybody on the other side. I, I mean, as I said, when I go to on my holidays, I I go to see family, but they're all dead. I mean, I'm not being funny, but they're the people I go to see. They're the ones in graves. You know, I know it sounds very morbid. No, no, yeah, But that's who I who I go because they can't fight me back. <laughs> they, can't be, <laughs> they can they listen. They have to listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> so it's kind yeah. of a joke I do anyway. But anyway, I see fam, I go to visit family. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. <laughs> in the graveyard. <laughs> wow. Anyway. No, but anyway, that was that was fantastic. That was from the from the two of you it was absolutely beautiful. I appreciate that. No. Oh, you're welcome, Susan. And, and look at that. That's just from winning a little A little out of a bowl. <laughs> out of the bowl. <laughs> there you go. See? <laughs> A crystal ball. <laughs> oh, crystal ball. That's special. That's special. Yes. Yes. Of um, course. Definitely. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, no. You, and I, you I, mentioned you mentioned before that you were going to go live. What What do you do? You were I said, to... go live. What? Say that again. Oh, oh, you were coming on the live here. Because I remember before yeah. you said you were going to go on the live, and I thought, what? Yeah. What is she doing? <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> well, you thought I was going to sing? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you don't know. That's no, what no. I was going to ask. <laughs> it's okay. That's okay. Right. No, I, I was just coming on live with yourself, the two of you. That's ah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> there was nothing else. No, yeah. No, that's all right. I'm not going. I'm not laughing. <laughs> I'll, I'll just. I'll just. I'll just tell you about it later. <laughs> Well, no, thanks, no. guys. I want to just no, you you're you. most welcome, Susan. No, thank, you. thank you. It's been yeah. lovely having you on. Yeah, and, and the same with you. It was lovely to talk. Very nice yeah. to talk. It All was right. very nice to meet you. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yes, it was nice to meet you. It was lovely to meet you as well. It's very hard on your texting or whatever. It's, you know, it is nice. Yeah. It is better <laughs> doing the reading live. I think so. so yeah. It's, it's yeah. a bit nerve wracking, though. I feel a bit nervous. But anyway. <laughs> No, 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 you're fine. Yeah. fine. But now, you've, now you've done it, you go and yeah. do it again. 
yeah, I'll be on all the time driving you crazy. <laughs> yeah, no, well, that's that's all right. That doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. That does no. not matter. We have a lot of people that come back on and, you know, just interacting with everybody else as well. So, yeah. 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 <laughs> We're oh. actually, we, we consider this group like a family. So yeah. there's a lot of people that come back. Yeah, it is nice. It is nice. And it, I was drawn today to it. I just felt... Oh, that's I, when I saw the two of you, I went, Oh, thank God. <laughs> yeah, so no. I said, yeah, I'll listen to this, it'll be fun, you know. So, there you go. <laughs> yeah, no, good, I'm glad. But yeah. you've, got right. a, you've got a wonderful smile as well, thank you. Definitely. And, and, and a great laugh. So, thanks, yeah. <laughs> Andrew. Um, Diana was just saying she was nervous too, and Andrew just said, Noise. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew just came on. <laughs> He's happy. <laughs> He's happy. He goes, noise. If you put it on the screen, you'll be able to see it. See? <laughs> no. Very good. Very good. Yeah. Oh, dear. Yeah. yeah. I, but thank you so okay, much guys. for letting us read you. All right. Thanks um, very much. And I'm going to I'm gonna conclude now because I don't want to be taking up any more time now, guys. No. you got to you got to get more out there. <laughs> yeah. You're, no, you're no, very good. Like, you, no, we we'll appreciate that. Them. Thank you. All right. Well, we'll okay. see. Thank okay. you. God bless. Yeah. Bye. But we'll see you Bye. in the comments. Bye. 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 You take care. Beautiful lady. Oh, really nice lady. Um, I was going to ask you, Paul, do you know, where is he? Uh, here we go. Jackson Flay. Um, no, he said, hi, Paul. Hello. <laughs> and, um, um, not, not, not hi, Paul Holmes. Are you sure it's not that Paul Holmes? Paul. No, no. All right. So, Julie, I'm about to send you the email. Um, I do apologise, Jackson. <laughs> How rude. You're a snob, Paul. No, but I, uh, I'm more of a, a face person. I, if I see their faces, then I'll... Uh, if you're still on, Jackson, and you know, actually know Paul, let us know. <laughs> um, okay. All right. Julie, I've just sent you the email. So you just need to um, close off Facebook and then go through your email. And as you go through the link, make sure you enable the camera and the mic, please. Okay. Oh, this is Paul on the left. And oh, yeah, I forgot. Sorry, Paul. There we yes. go. Yes. No. Is that better, Paul Holmes? That's better. I feel like I'm not on balance now. No, that's, that's wrong. That's better. <laughs> yeah, that's better. Oh, I forgot. I did a bit of switcheroo earlier. <laughs> switcheroo? We, we, I nearly have to get the bucket. Yeah, mixing it up, Andrew. Andrew, you're lucky I didn't do that to you on Sunday. You would have become very dizzy. <laughs> we would have been dizzy lizzies. Hello, Andrew. How are you doing? I've, I've seen the show and, yeah, it was quite good. So well done. <laughs> um, no, it's good. Yeah, no, we had a good show. For everybody that's on, Andrew and I were on on Sunday. Andrew's an energy healer and um, he was doing healing on the live um, while I was doing some readings. That was on Sunday. And I was sleepwalking. And Paul was sleepwalking in the streets of the UK. Yes, with his Where's Wally's t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's, it, it was, uh, you know, I, well, it kept me fit anyway. Yeah, yeah. he's. Uh... <laughs> I, I actually, I actually woke up and I got a, you know, some handprints on me bum. Oh, you're kidding me! How yeah. embarrassing! What were you doing? Well, they weren't me that <laughs> did it. <laughs> I think some that was Sarah. I think well, after she oh, put Sarah, me in the, are you still yeah. on Sarah? What were, what were you guys up to? <laughs> no, I think 
she goes, no, that's when she was pushing me into the, the garage. And she had, she'd been doing some painting. Oh, yeah. Sarah Martin said, um, yes, in her shed. So <laughs> what were you guys getting up to? You're most welcome, Susan. <laughs> no, thank you, Susan. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, no, that's all right, Jackson. Oops, where is he? There he is. Jackson said his mum sent him the live, so he jumped on and wanted to say hello. No, that you, you're welcome, Jackson. I just thought maybe you might have known Paul. Maybe we know your mum. Possibly. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, Julie said that email isn't working, so I'm just going to send it to another one she just sent me. Right. Um, all right, Julie, I'm going to send it to that second email. Okie dokie. La -dee -da. Okay, Julie, I've sent it to the other email now. See how you go. Uh, <laughs> who had their hands on, on your ass? <laughs> it was Sarah Martin. Sarah Martin, what have you been doing? <laughs> it's when she was pushing me into the shed. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. I guess I'll never know. Uh, where are you from, Jackson? Yeah, I haven't, you, I haven't seen him on before. Yeah, where are you, where are you from, Jackson? I like that way of spelling his name, Jackson. Hmm. Paul got a spanking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Queensland. Oh, Jackson. I'm in Melbourne. <laughs> A shed for groping asses. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Holmes. <laughs> hey, did you find your teeth, Paul? Okay, Julie's coming on. Oh, hello. <laughs> ah, there oh, she is. No. <laughs> it worked, it worked. <laughs> <laughs> I was getting worried there. I thought, oh no, I hope it's going to work. <laughs> How are you, Julie? The other email. Oh, sorry. Can you say something? Yeah. Good. Fantastic. Yeah. Oh, it's me, okay. my ears gone out of, out of shot. I'm trying to listen to see if you have an accent. <laughs> <laughs> Where about you from? I'm from Newcastle in England. Ah, <laughs> your neck of the woods, oh. Paul. Yep, no, Jordan. no, it's the other end of the country. <laughs> <laughs> if you oh. get in a car, it's about four hours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Last time I was up there, my team Luton played up there. Oh, okay. There was there was nearly ten thousand of us up there. Oh. Which was amazing. Yeah. Oh, I love it up there. It we because when was it? It was in January. God, it was bloody cold. <laughs> it's always cold up there, though. The closer, you, the, cl the closer you get to Scotland. Sarah yeah. said that she's got a shed for naughty boys called Paul. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. And I won't tell you what Diana said. Sarah has... <laughs> oh, I, 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 are you seeing this, Julie? Yeah. <laughs> so, I'm pretty cheeky. Uh, <laughs> we were on Sunday. We were um, asking people to keep an eye out because Paul was sleepwalking in the street there in the UK, and um, Sarah Martin said she, if she saw him, she was just going to shut her curtains. <laughs> I don't know. So. <clears throat> What do you think of our show then, as in the concept? Really good. Really yeah. Good. Yeah. Yeah. So, do, does it give you a lift? Uh, helps you get through the day. Mm -hmm. You know. How, yeah. how do how do we work? You work really well together. It's a good combination. No, we appreciate yeah. that. Do you know, every time I hear your voice, all I can think of is Ant and Deck. Yeah, <laughs> well, Dex, Dex a friend of mine anyway. Is he? <laughs> yeah. Oh, get his autograph for me. <laughs> you know where we are. 
Yeah, get him to come on the show. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> yeah, get him to come on the show. We get get some celebrities. I don't even I don't even know who they are. I'm sorry. Oh, they're, 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 they're funny. Let's put it that way. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Because when I was last down in London, I was I actually went to see them. Um, while they would, I was going to go and see them, but the security guard wouldn't let me in. So. But uh, that was just before they moved from where they are now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, oh, well, oh, that hurt. oh, thank you, Andrew. Look what Andrew wrote. Isn't that what? nice? Uh, like the format. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's good. Thank you, but, Andrew. Uh, no, it's just nice. What's the weather like up there at the moment? Sunny. Sunny? We're, we're getting yeah. all the sun. We're getting all the bloody cloud. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because normally sunny. you've got the cloud and we've got the sun. Yeah. But it seems like it's turning around. around. Yeah. Yeah. So it's all bathers, bathers this afternoon, is it? I'm working. <laughs> I'm just on lunch break. <laughs> oh, oh, are you? So yeah. we're oh, yeah. up then. <laughs> are you working from home? I'm working from home, yeah. Oh, oh that's all that, right. That's good enough then. We don't just have to rush. Just tell them you've gone to the bathroom or something. <laughs> just in case they message you oh. So, so do you I don't have any, I don't have any meetings today, so it'll be fine. Uh, <laughs> yeah, because when you said you're at work or yeah, working, I thought, oh, we're going to get people walking pa past in a minute. <laughs> 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 oh, how close are you, Savannah? Almost. Oh, she's nearly there. But, no, but um, yeah, have you enjoyed the show today so far? I have, yes, really good. Yeah. Keep watching, definitely. Yeah, yeah. I forgot to ask, are you a Newcastle fan? Definitely. Yeah? Yes. So, Wonderful. oh, yeah, because we nearly beat you. Nearly. <laughs> nearly, because yeah. one of our goals wasn't offside. <laughs> <laughs> it was given offside, but it wasn't. <laughs> We, um, I don't know what this means. Mark's grandfather used to live and raised up on Portobello Road. That's London. Is that who you were talking about before? No, I don't know who Andrew's talking about. I know, not do I, because that's in London. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew? Uh, okay. No, because um, did you go to that game? Probably. I haven't been for a while, but I used to go quite regular. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because when we were there, it was – it's a nice ground. Mm -hmm. Really nice ground. Yeah. I, I, yeah. Nice city as well. Oh, it is. I tell you, the friendliest people. Definitely. Yeah, because um, – where were we? We were in Burger King or somewhere, and um, I actually wound up <laughs> some of the – not meaning to, but wound up some because uh, I said we're we're definitely going to beat you because, and I said something else, and they went, ah, oh, now we're going to beat. You. I said, don't worry, I'm only joking. You you're going to beat us outright, <laughs> but you know because we sat right up in the gods, right up in the top. Yeah, yeah. I think I think I had about sixteen pairs of tops on there. It was so cold. Yeah. You actually just stayed up this season, didn't you? Uh -huh. Only just. Only just, yeah. <laughs> oh, do you reckon you'll go down next season? No, so definitely we're not. We're talking football. Uh -huh. I'm I'm trying to waste a bit of time so Savannah right. can get the cards done. <laughs> yeah, no, I've pulled out the cards. Are you ready now? Yeah, I've yeah. pulled out some interesting cards, actually. Right. Oh, that's good then. Right, I'll because what I will do, I'll mute myself, and then you can do the reading for Julie, and then I'll do my bit. But as as per normal, try not don't say anything until I've done my bit. So, okay. thank you very much, and thank you for your donation thank you. too. No yes, problem. thank you. Thank you. No problem. Okay. Righty ho. Right. Oh. There you go, you've gone back into focus again because you've gone out of focus. Who? No. Oh, I, I, I can fix that. No. There we go. 
No, Julie, no, uh, the reception wasn't very good. Oh, okay. Do you want the screen the other oh. way or this way? No, don't, don't, don't oh. We're, we're <laughs> all going to get <laughs> It's like a roller coaster, isn't it? <laughs> hey. Yeah. Okay. Right. Let's go. Now, all right. So, Julie, what I'm getting for you here, you're actually a, you're a very hard worker, and um, I need to tell you to find balance. Um, find the balance between you know your work and time for yourself and having rest. Um, you know, take time out to do things for yourself. Feel the sunshine on your face. Go out for a little bit. Um, you know, don't always um, bury yourself in work, um, you know, or doing things for others. Uh, but making sure as well that you, you take time to rest, even if you have power naps, make sure that you can recharge and replenish yourself. Um, I'm also getting here, you could be a bit of a workaholic, um, but um, it, and that in its in itself is um, like can affect you in ba being able to uh, function or being able to operate um, in your power. Um, and when I say that, I don't mean like in the work that you do, but in other things, because I'm also getting here that you're actually quite spiritual yourself. Um, you could even do cards. Um, I don't know whether you've dabbled in that at all, but I'm finding that um, that is actually a gift that you have. Um, I feel that um, you, you may have been having daydreams, like daydreams that you've been having are actually messages that are being sent to you. Um, there's sort of like visions at play, <laughs> a video <laughs> at play. <laughs> That's all right. right I'll, I'll just mute. I'll mute. So what I've muted, so don't worry, Julie, I can't hear it. And um, so what it is like the visions that you're having, the, you would think of them as daydreams, but they're actually messages that are being put in, like into you, being sent to you. And, you know, and you're probably thinking they're, they're daydreams, but they're actual things that you may be desiring, things that, um, uh, you know, th that you, you can start um, like manifest for yourself because... Um, I've got here like um, taking back your power. So you, you've got the angel here forwarding and sending your power back to you. Um, it's like um, you're kind of zapped. You're not being your true self. You're, you're just um, you're going through the motions, but you're not living. Your true self hasn't come out. Now, um, I need to tell you to be open to, re to receiving because you uh, you will be receiving abundance. And when I mean that, is it's not just monetary, but also opportunities. You'll have opportunities coming and knocking at your door, but you need to surrender to your journey. So you need to release perhaps the control that you have. Sometimes things can be a bit um, scary and um, when you go into the unknown, but um, you'll find that if you release, contr release control and trust yourself and the voice that you have in you and the the visions that you're having the messages that you're getting you you'll find that the light will light up your pathway you'll see it more clearly um but i do feel that you can actually do what i'm doing here um you have that in you and, and um it was it would it's a wonderful gift and it's something you could use to help other people uh, this is all I'm getting for you, but um, don't say anything yet, or you can't because I've muted you anyway. <laughs> but Paul now is, once he unmutes himself, he's going to um, give you the, his reading now. <laughs> Righty ho. Sorry, I was quickly doing something yeah. my camera's gone all dark on me 
Right, let's see what we can get for you then, Julie. <laughs> right, let's see what we can get. Well, <laughs> uh, with yourself, the first thing I get, okay, it's so much peace. It's just so much peace within you, okay? That peace will or has been with you for many years. Um, it has taken you, it didn't, well, no, you've had it since you were a child. This, and before that as well. It's like you, it's like you, when you come into, when you, when you get reincarnated, you know, when your soul goes into another soul, uh, body, you, you've actually brought this calmness with you all the time, you know, but it's getting better and stronger every single time that you come or move forward in life okay but there's so much happiness and wonderfulness with you uh this is similar to what Silvana was saying i do apologize if it sounds the same but i'm just getting that that this it's like people could come up to you and give you a hug okay and that hug from yourself would release some great energy okay um you like myself as well and Silvana said this as well uh if if they come into your like bubble you know you'll find that they help you know, you just basically help them but it feels like there is healing there though it feels like there's a healing type you know it's like hands-on healing like reiki or something similar to that but uh, you you have um like i say you've been doing this for so many years it's just um when you first start when you first understood in this life in this journey that you had this you just wanted to take it as far as you could uh, or as far you just wanted to know where it was going to take you. And you wanted to know that um, wherever it took you, you wanted to make as many people happy and as many people understand that life is something amazing. Okay? You um, you like to talk to people. You like to take people um, on face value, you know, Sometimes people go, right, oh, th they live on the streets. We're not going to talk to them. You you're going to talk to them no matter what. It doesn't matter who, you know. Um, but you'll also give those people that are putting those people down a piece of your mind, as it were. It feels like you'll go, you'll, you'll tell them off. You will tell them off because you know that... Uh, they're saying the wrong things. But you've got, um, it feels like there's some new things coming up as well uh, with you. Um, but you've got a, it's like a new challenge in your journey. Okay. But you've got to relax and understand that um, it's going to help you. It's going to help you. And it's going to not just help you, it's going to help whoever is standing close to you, okay? But there's also something that um, I'm getting, it's like a, like a, um, you, somebody's going to leave somewhere, okay, to move forward again, okay? Someone wants to leave to, uh, to, to either move their journey on, or just go and what's the word to progress their life um, and, and it feels like it's going it feels like someone wants to leave 
this area and move abroad. It feels like someone wants to go abroad and take, you know, their chances going somewhere. And it feels like once they get there, it'll be a little difficult, but then it will be amazing because they'll, they have some uh, wonderful things inside them that will help them too. Yeah, but there's a lot of learning um, inside to be done also with yourself. Um, life is going to, it feels like there's, life itself is just ins and outs. It's like, shall I, shan't I type things. I, 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 that's the only way I can explain it. It's shall I, shan't I, you know, but you, you already know the answers to these. You, you know that you need to take certain steps to move yourself away from certain things in life, yeah? But but I'm also getting, it's like a new side of, I'm, I've been getting business as well with this, and it feels like somebody has to go to a bank to get either a loan, or it feels like, yeah, a loan. Yeah, so that this can happen, okay? So that somebody can actually progress. And I keep saying progress, 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 but that that's all I seem to be getting is at the moment. But to me, this is a second chance as well. So don't don't give up on this one because this, this one is, it, it feels like it's the last chance. Last chance saloon, as they say, okay? But it's not just for, get, I think this has something to also to do with a lot, uh, the leaf thing as well. You know, it's like the last chance because everybody's getting a bit too, I know this is going to sound rude, but a bit too old in the tooth to move, to take it too much further, okay? But it, the work... The work life, uh, this is just, yeah, I don't know. That that just seems to be something that you only do every now and again. Okay, just just to try and get some funding in. But I think that's why the 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 bank and the 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 loan and the and the starting or progressing the business. Yeah, it's like I don't know what work thing keep it's coming in, it's coming in, but it, it'll all work. It'll all gel. It will seriously gel because it, it it looks like something you need. But I do get like tears with this because it's like I've been waiting for this for ages. Been waiting for this for ages. Yeah, but I'm gonna leave that one with you. And I hope that resonated with yourself because as per normal, it all sounds like gobbledygook to us. <laughs> but, yeah. but I hope yeah. that yourself. I'll just pack all Alexander then, Julie. <laughs> Absolutely spot on, both, both of you. So I am, I've always been spiritual. Um, but I've, I'm being told I'm going through a spiritual awakening um, in October. My husband left us after 27 years. Um, so I've started to obviously progress it again because uh, my husband like didn't didn't like it, didn't want us to progress. So I was like held back. So I've been told that I'm a, um, an empath, a healer, a soul, a star seed, um, a light worker, and some have even said clairvoyant. Um, so it's it's something that I've always wanted to do to communicate with spirit. Um, yeah. But yeah. Just everything you've said, it just makes total sense. Yeah. Oh, wow. Sense. Do Thank you know? You. I've, been, I've, I've always, I've yeah. always wanted to help people all my life. Mm. I give someone my last, you know, that type of person. Do you know a lot of people were commenting, um, saying that you, you look like a very strong, confident woman 
Um, they were all commenting. Th like I think I've got one here I can put on the screen there. And, um, and um, you know, someone was saying here that you hold yourself very well. And everybody was commenting. They were in awe. You've got like this um, energy around you. You have this like aura energy around you and everyone could actually see it. Yeah. I've been told I've got pink energy. I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good with the colours and stuff, but um, yeah. I just, yeah, um, Andrew, so Andrew is actually an energy healer and he's on here at the moment. He's watching and he he can actually, he's quite good with energies and he's saying, a healer, maybe. No, um, healer, baby, baby. Yeah, but I think he meant maybe. You didn't mean <laughs> healer, baby, did you, Andrew? <laughs> healer, baby. Pink, um, Andrew is saying that pink is heart energy healing. Hmm. So, um, and Diana, Diana yeah. is in Canada, and she's saying. Don't hold back, girlfriend. Let it go. <laughs> That's to you, Julie. Thank hey, you. It was baby. It was <laughs> baby. I don't yeah. know. What have you been doing, Andrew? <laughs> no, as, just as, soon as, as soon as I connected with you, Julie, the, the energy was so calming. Mm -hmm. It was so calming. I, and I, I, I could have splurted out everything, but you know all the answers anyway. Yeah. Yeah. You know, certain answers. You know, we, we just gave you hints of come on, kick you up the bum job. Yes. <laughs> like I get yeah. lots of um, feathers and signs and angel numbers and things like that as well. Wow. I've started to, I've started to notice more. Yeah. yeah. Since my husband left me, actually, so it's really progressing, I feel now. Yeah. Do you, do you get to see a uh, spirit yet? No. Um, two days ago, I, um, obviously, I, I meditate as well, so I start to meditate for 20 minutes every day. Oh, and good. In, in my mind's okay. eye, I saw, it was just blackness up until two days ago. I seen like, a, um, I can only describe mm. it as like a portal, but it was like purple. Ah, and it was, yeah. And it was like glistening and moving and like pulsating. Mm -hmm. Wow. Um, but I've never, I've never had it since, though. That was two days ago. Yeah. No, but they they're just showing you. They're giving you glimpses. You know, this is just to say, come on, you you. This is what you want. You're going to have it. You know, but you need to put the work in as much as what. Yeah. When we help you, you need to put your two pennies worth in, as it were. Yeah. Yeah. And I've, um, I'm on a, like a psychic development course as well, and 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 the tarot cards as well. I've enrolled on that to try and help us. That, that's good. That's good. Yeah. No, but you know, if we if we see you on, you know, coming on onto your own little channel, Sorry. then yeah, yeah. That, um, Andrea, amazing. Andrea does trance healing, and she's just commented, "Purple is great to see in your mind's eye." Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it is a beautiful uh, colour. It's a spiritual colour. Sorry, what were you saying? And I just say it's a spiritual colour. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It is. Hmm. And um, what Diana's asking you a question. Um, I, Diana said she's in nursing, and she asked what you do, Julie. Um, I work in Newcastle, Newcastle University. Oh, in university. Yeah. Um, Diana. So wow. Wow. Yeah. Gold. <laughs> no. So so did you enjoy that? I did. Really did. Yeah. Thank you. Now we appreciate all the great comments from everybody. Yeah. You know, um, it is. It's, it's just. But I love doing it. But when once you start doing this yourself, getting mm. out there, do, do you actually go out and tell people things yet? No, I've, as I said, I've just started with like because believing is I've just more or less got into it, sort of no, now. No, no. I mean because sometimes you can yeah. actually without doing any development, um, you can still give information to people mm. you know i didn't even know i got the gift and then yeah. I, I was i was telling people things yeah and i was thinking I've, how do I've i know always, these yeah i've always been able to sort of finish people's sentences off and i've always known what they're thinking mm. so like, you always so, knew it was there yeah people must find that annoying 
yeah. I'll do that now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've always, I've always like had annoying, annoying if you like about things, certain things. Yeah, yeah. 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 That'll, that'll increase you're going to enjoy it. Well. Just yeah. enjoy it. Enjoy the journey because it doesn't matter how late wow. in life or how young in life, you know. Now, um, Andrea, sorry, Paul. Yeah, go, go on. Go on, you say uh, it. Andrea, um, <laughs> yeah, Andrea is, um, she's the trans healer um, and um, she's um, saying that she's getting told to say to you, um, Julie, automatic writing. There you go. No, that's quite good because I do that. Uh, Andrew said he's got a question for Julie. Oh, Andrew is, yeah, Andrew is the energy healer I was telling you about. Um, right. So he said, okay, go ahead, Andrew. All right, go on, in. Come on, Andrew, spit it out. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Andrew. <laughs> What's I your question? I half a page. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we know. Go on. Look, he's look at this. typing it out. This is this is what you'll be getting. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, Andrea. Andrew's a one finger typer. I'm two. Uh, now Andrew's got his question. Yes, yeah, Sarah. I think he did go to the toilet. Now, <laughs> Again. He's asking Julie. Have you seen any UFO activity? No. No. But I've been told by um, a medium that I can or will be able to communicate with different species, if you like, different. Yes. In that, yeah, in that, that sure event. Yeah. It's not yeah. Seed, yeah. yeah. Like a okay. different planet and, yeah. I, I do that. Do you? Yeah. I tell you, it's, it's fun because they all stand in my living room. <laughs> 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 they come and visit. It sound, I know it sounds a bit over the top for some people. But it is one of the best things because you get to – it's like that – you know, like Star Trek where they just materialise? Yeah. That's what they do yeah. because nothing also, nothing that we're living in is there for them. They're in a different time. So everything that we're living in is non-existent, you know. Yeah. It's when you see the ships hovering above your head. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They're the ones. Um, oh, Andrea, yeah. well, um, you're saying I have another being as well, and you're saying yes, yes, yes. Are you saying like you see UFOs, or do you mean something else? Oh, right. She's got. To, she's got to write the answer. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. No, that's all right. Um, and Paul. Uh, so Andrew is saying yes. I've seen the ships, Paul. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, I have another life force in trance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I could go into a whole load of different stories, but that's not, you know, that would take us forever to yeah. talk about. So that'll have to go in the book that I, I'll have to write. <laughs> that's chapter two. <laughs> yeah, that's just chapter two. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. But, do, you, uh, do you recommend going into like an open circle at a spiritualist church to help me? Do you think that would? That's up to help? you. Okay. That's up to you. If you feel you should, then you go with it. If you feel you shouldn't, if it feels like you're being pushed away from it, don't. Mm, okay. Because okay. I personally, I've never been trained in a in a church or anything. Or, or anything like that. Luckily, I had a friend that trained me, and we it, it was like this, where we'd have a laugh, a joke, and and it was funny. But we, we'd have a laugh and a joke, but the serious stuff was yeah. really serious. Yeah. That's um, what I think. I, need. I think I need some sort of mentor to help us. A good way to start. Okay. Andrew is saying it doesn't have to be a church. No, no. It could be like a, you know, you know how you're doing your training. Maybe people there. Right. Yeah, because some I I just got somebody will suddenly appear, and help you. Okay. You know, <clears throat> and just just to guide you. Somebody 
that's going to go above and beyond to help you. But if they if they start to charge, I wouldn't, because <laughs> this this would be for free. It should. I think they'll they should do it for free. Yeah, because yeah. you know your you know it's your your journey, and that a lot of people tend to want to take too much from it because they'll yeah. overcharge. They'll overcharge. Yeah. I know it's their time and everything, but it will help them also. So it's like it's going to be one of each. You know, it's helping you and it's going to help them as well. But mm -hmm. um, but personally, like I say, it's up to you what how you go about it. Okay. You know, it's up to yourself because we can't. We can give you words on readings and stuff, but you aren't. Um, yeah. And certain things, but problem. but you you need to you need to work these things out as well. Okay. Yeah, with your energies, because you know, um, but that'd be fun. But yes. So yeah, uh, we we're, we're glad that you enjoyed that. I'm thankful yes, that you joined you. us. And we appreciate, because I haven't heard a Newcastle accent, like I say, since Ant and Deck. <laughs> Thank I think you so much. Thank Sorry? you for your donation as well, Julie. I was just going to say that, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. But, Thank you so, for the lovely evening. Thank you. But like I said, we're, we're actually, I was looking to get uh, in contact with them at one point because they do that. Um, that is that that talking thing on ITV, uh, Ant and Deck, yeah. Because I I don't know, because I want them to see what we do, mm -hmm. and see if it compares to what they do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I think they copied us. You see, I think they copied us. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them, yeah. But you have a great day. Diana's thanking you, Julie, as well. Yeah, everyone's saying thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And yeah. They're all, uh, I don't know what pictures these are that Andrew put up here. Yeah. But we, we stayed sure. in a place called Ponteland as well. All oh, right, yeah. Yeah, in a lovely cottage just outside, mm -hmm. right next to a pig farm. <laughs> but it was um, a be beautiful place, beautiful place. Yeah. Yes. Um, Julie, Sarah Martin is in the UK and she said, um, I've just po put it up on the screen, to feel free to message her anytime if you want for a chat. Thank you. And, you oh, Andrew posted clapping hands. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I did, they didn't look like hands. I didn't know. <laughs> they looked like potatoes. <laughs> Potatoes? Yeah, that's what they look like, potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> but um, thank you so much, Julie, for coming on. No and, problem, thank uh, you very much for the reading. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll let you, you're, you're most welcome, and we'll let you get back. I don't want you to yeah. get in trouble with your work or anything. But, um, but, don't, but don't forget to let us know, you know, like get us out there uh, as well. Yeah. And that goes to all the other people as well listening. Yeah, yeah, come back, like come and join our chats and let us know how you're going and everything, you know. Yeah, I will do. But, yeah, but don't forget, um, everybody out there, the more people that notice us, the the more people come on and on the lives and and you know, in, interact with us as well, you know, which is fantastic. But thank you again, Julie. Yeah, thank and you. I, so. I know we keep saying it, but you've got a great energy. Yes. Um, <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'll blow you a kiss. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thanks, okay, you. See you, Julie. Bye. Bye. You Bye. take care. Bye. Bye. Another beautiful lady. Yeah. Oh, I didn't show Julie that. Um, Sarah Martin, are they undies? I think so. <laughs> Do I need new glasses? These are new glasses. Actually, no, these are the... Um, my new ones are in my bag, actually. <laughs> what was oh because I thought they were potatoes. Oh right. <laughs> I was going to say I'm not squinting. Oh, why? Why are you got? Why have you undies on there? 
Yeah, why is she put undies on there? Yeah, why be put? You know, because you left because when you were sleepwalking, you left your undies over there when she locked you in the shed. Oh, so I was walking around near enough completely yeah, naked. You were walking around in your g-string, everyone said it. Oh, cheers. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I actually put them in your washing machine to wash them. Oh, Sarah, it's he's contaminated. Um, he's contaminated your washing now. <laughs> Undies and toilets. Yeah, I noticed that she, yeah, she's been putting up undies and toilets. <laughs> she's got a new box of undies. Oh, did you have undies delivered, Sarah? Oh, he broke your washing machine. Ah. Well, Courtney, I'm about to pull out another name. So you're in the drawer. So let's see how we go. <laughs> Uh, come on then Let, let's see let's have the drum right. roll as they say but thank you to uh thank you to julie julie again yeah amazing thank you but everybody that comes on um and onto our show amazing all right yep. so i'm just gonna pull out use the toilet to what oh he used the toilet to wash his undies Okay, so that's why she's been pulling up the toilet. Um, hi, Dee. Hang on, let me check. If Dee's shared, I'll put them in the drawer. Uh, <laughs> hang on a sec. I just saw Dee. Oh, dearie me. What's What's Andrew got there? I don't know. What's that a picture of? Owls? Undies. Yeah, they're owls. <laughs> are they undies or owls, Andrew? Oh, drum roll. They're drums. Oh! <laughs> I think we've got undies on the brain. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm so sorry. <laughs> You've definitely got undies on the brain. <laughs> it's your fault, Paul. You won't stop with your undies. <laughs> Building the anticipation. Come yeah. on. Oh, I might win it one day. All right, let's see who we've got. <gasps> Joe Bloggs. Oh, I don't think this person's on. I haven't oh. seen it. Sunny Skies. No. <laughs> I think she's gone I don't, home. I don't think they're on. Sunny. Sunny. She's hiding in the bathroom in case I get chosen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't think Sonny's on. So, Sonny, I'll give you 30 seconds. Your boys are waking up. Oh, no, Courtney. You're hiding in the bathroom in case you get chosen. <laughs> <laughs> Drums from down under. Yes. Diana, Andrew was actually on with me on Sunday and he was doing healing remotely on the live. So... Okay, all right, so Sonny's not on, so we're going to pull out another name. Oh, never got to do me elevator music. <laughs> That's all right. On the okay, I'm, I'm not sure nice. if this person is on either because um, <laughs> I haven't seen them comment. Um, Amy McFarlane Thorpe. I haven't seen her name for a while. She was on earlier, but I'll give her 30 seconds, but I have a feeling she's not on now. Andrew, I respect your gift very much. <gasps> do, 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 do. Amy, Amy. <laughs> oh, no. She's definitely not there. No, she's not there. All right, I'm going to pull out another name. Oh, well. All righty. Who... Somebody's somebody who's on here. Oh, Amy's not on. No, there's another one. Amy's not on. Here's another one. I don't think they're on either. <laughs> These are people that came on early, but um, we didn't do the, like we don't do the re. Who's your sister-in-law? Um, Amy is Amy your sister-in-law, Andrea? Wow. Um, okay, Jacqueline Flay. Jacqueline Flay. 
But I, I don't um I don't think she's on either. I've been hanging in since the start. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least you're in the bathroom, so if you have to go, you didn't have to go far. <laughs> oh, right. Radio, come on. Yeah, so I don't think. Oh, she's there. She's it's there. Jacqueline. Jacqueline, I didn't think you were there anymore. <laughs> Okay, so Jacqueline, would you like to come on live for your reading like the others have? Or would you like it through the comments? Congratulations. <coughs> live, live. Come on. We can we can do this. Yeah, we've had a couple of people come on today and it's been good. Mm. Andrew's saying, do it, do it, do it, do <laughs> it. Oh, look, live pants, toilet pants. Sarah, look, that's <laughs> live to pants, toilet pants. <gasps> Jacqueline said live, yes. <laughs> okay. The man from um, Del Monte, he said yes. Yeah, so Jacqueline, could you please send me your email address on Messenger to this page? Once you send it to me, I will email you the invite and all you need to do is turn off your Facebook, go to the email and click on the link that's in the email and as you're coming through here, make sure that you enable your mic and your camera. So I'll just wait for your email address. Yes, okay. Andrea, we're on fire tonight. I love it when people come on live. It's so much better, isn't it, Paul? Oh, definitely. You know, because um, like we've said before, you get to see the people and, yeah. um, you know, um, we get a better interaction. I know. Um, um, sorry. No, go on. Courtney, we don't actually have a, a time period that we do the lives. It's when we run out of energy. Uh, when we do readings for people, it uses up energy because, like, the connection that we do um, and, and the energy that we draw, draw from, it actually drains us. So when we reach the point of we can't anymore because, like, if we just keep going, we're not really giving you a proper reading. Um so uh, that's why we I do the draws um, and we do offer if you do want priority that yours is done, then um, if you make a donation, we will do yours next. But, yeah, so there's not really like a, a time frame or anything like that. <laughs> yeah, well, we, we try. We, we do try, you know. Um, you know, we might be full of energy now, and then all of a sudden we'll just go, <laughs> the yeah. energy will just drop. Yeah. No, that's all right, Courtney. I don't mind that you asked. I really want to see Courtney's bathroom. <laughs> yeah, I want to see Courtney's bathroom too. All right, so I've got the um, – even Paul Holmes wants to see Courtney's bathroom. I know, I never bathroom. said that. I was just reading that. <laughs> Okay, now I've got Jacqueline's email address. Uh, uh huh, uh huh. Okay. <laughs> Kids aren't shy. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear me. <laughs> Blimey. Okay, no. Jacqueline, I've just sent you the email. Uh, don't forget to turn off your Facebook, please, and then um, and come through. <laughs> There's two people that don't have teeth. Who hasn't got their, their teeth? Gianna's saying it. Jackie and Paul H. said they don't have their teeth in. <laughs> yes. Uh, I remember Paul said his dog had the teeth. We already have Diana's 
kid on on his shoe issue. <laughs> Always fun. <laughs> I know that was funny. That was so funny. I couldn't stop laughing. <laughs> I may look a bit silly if I do come on, come on in bathroom, cross legged on my toilet lid. <laughs> I gave my headset. Do you know we've had we've had people come on in in there, you know, sitting in their uh, where, where, where were they sitting? They're just sitting there watching the telly. Yeah. Yeah. And in their dressing gowns. Sarah Martin was in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> skivvies. <laughs> in their skivvies. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, Hi, Kat. How are you? Hello, Kat. Um, Kat, what we're doing is um, if you want a free mini reading from both of us, um, you can share our live and um, we can put you in the draw. Or if you'd like a guaranteed reading, um, if you make a donation, that will give you priority. And I have posted the links for that in the comments below. Hmm. <laughs> Hair design, what? What am I looking at? Uh, blimey, that is ha! Ah. Wow, there she is. <laughs> Jacqueline. Hello. Hello. <laughs> oh, my God, how are you? I'm fine. Nervous, <laughs> you're nervous. You don't need to be nervous, it's just us. <laughs> yeah, it's just yeah, us. Okay. Don't worry. Yeah, so what part of the country are you from? Well, Queensland, <gasps> Queensland, Australia. Okay, okay. Close to your area then, Savannah? Uh, no, I'm in Melbourne, so Queensland. Well, well, it's closer uh, than to me. Oh, yeah, I'm closer <laughs> to her than you are. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is saying hi to you, um, Jacqueline. And, oh, Andrea, see you, Andrea. She's got to put her daughter to bed. See you later, Andrea. <laughs> yes, oh. and Paul Holmes wants you to wear a pink dress, Paul. What? No, Andrew's not going. <laughs> Andrea is. <laughs> Sorry <laughs> about that. <laughs> he wants me to wear a pink dress. Yes. Pretty. Yeah, pink is your colour. I, I don't suit pink. Yeah. Diana's also <laughs> saying hello to you, Jacqueline. <laughs> uh, hello. Wow. <laughs> no, and but... Andrew is saying hello to you as well. And so is Susan. Susan was on here earlier. She's saying yeah, hello to you Susan. as well. <laughs> yeah. You're but... very popular, Jacqueline. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Um, Andrew is saying salmon, um, Paul. You can wear a salmon coloured dress. I see Paul in a sequin lime green speedo thing. <laughs> the lady from Ireland mentioned. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh. I am definitely not wearing that. <laughs> so, Jacqueline. So, I, I had to shout then because I thought you were falling. No. <laughs> Just to wake you up. No. What do you think of the concept of our show? Say that again. What Pardon? do you think of the concept of our show? I think it's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah good. Can you hear me? Good. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm smiling oh. because it's nice to hear an, an uh, Australian accent. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only one. <laughs> oh, I sound funny, why not? I? <laughs> nah, well, there's two of us. <laughs> no, because I'm looking like at you. <laughs> Because I'm watching you, 
and it's like there's a delayed reaction. Um, it's, it's yeah. like, there is yeah. from her her lips and her the voice is it, there's a delayed reaction. Andrew is saying nice. And Susan said a green lumin lum I can't, luminous luminous lum I can't L say it luminous yes mankini for you. <laughs> oh, I am not wearing a mankini. <laughs> <laughs> Only at the beach. No, um, but uh, no. So, I don't know, is this the first time you've been here? I can't remember. I don't think. No, I wasn't on. So that again, sorry, I, I couldn't hear you. So I open. I've, I've watched you guys a couple of times. Oh, okay. This is about my third, All right, so, my third time. Sometimes it's very difficult to uh, remember everyone that's come on. Um, yeah. But, uh, yeah, we're grateful that you've, you know, um, taken the time today to come in and, and interact with us. So what are you thinking of the show today? Is it, I'm liking know? it, yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. we've had some good laughs. We're definitely having some yeah. good laughs. <laughs>, <laughs> you know. But uh, my laughs, uh, I, I will, I, I'm going to, I can't even speak now. I think the energy is starting to get to me. Um, <laughs> but we'll, we'll, we're going to give you the best reading we can, or mini reading we can. And then, uh, yeah. you know, but uh, yeah, how, how do you like that? How, the, how do you like the way that we both read? I do. I do. Yes. Because there's the one who does the, the cards and then there's myself, you know, who just sits here and yeah, basically. <laughs> but you're funny. <laughs> he is funny. <laughs> yeah. I try my best. I try my best. You know, you're this, is, this is just natural. This is just not my natural self. You know. Pretty cool. Nothing, nothing put on. It's just one of them things that, yeah. uh, you know, and, and I think that's what a lot of people like about us because we, we're more natural than just going, yeah, because um, we have watched a few of the other people. You know, nothing against them, but sometimes you go into their little comment section and they, they just want you to... Uh, they keep, they say, there you go, there's your card, and then you're off. It's like you're on a conveyor belt. Yeah. You know, and, you know, you've got about 30 seconds for a reading or something, or, you know, whatever they read off the card. But, uh, you know, I, I'm i being biased here, but I love I love our show. You know, I'm being That's really good. biased. You know, You're meant to. I love, I, I love the people that come on. I really love, I love the, the people. people that come on because, as we've said, we're a, we're a family, you know. And oh, what's that? What about your lip gloss, Paul? Oh, Diana, I haven't worn my blonde wig for a while. Um. No, when um, Jacqueline, you probably haven't seen it now. And uh, I've worn a, a a blonde wig, and uh, I'm known as Pandora when I wear it. <laughs> so um, yeah, someone's actually brought it up with my blonde wig. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I've actually I've got yeah. the cards ready. So okay. what we're, what we're going to do is. Um, uh, I'll, I'll do your reading, and um, but don't say any. He Paul's already muted himself, so <laughs> which is good. So when I finish your reading, don't say anything yet. We'll wait for Paul to do his, and then you can give us your feedback. Um, yep. Okay. All right. So um, what what I'm getting for you, uh, Jacqueline, is that. 
At the moment, there I, I feel that there is like a disharmony um, around a group that you're with, whether it's your family, um, people you work with, or friends. And I feel that there's a disharmony, like arguments, um, things not people not resonating with one another, and. Um, and I, I feel I need to tell you sort of to let go of that situation because trying to control it and the outcome of it can sabotage your sabotage your relationship, um, your relationship with this person or people. Um, just to have a more uh, a better result, um, a better outcome, it's the best thing to do is just to step back, regroup. And um, and just give this person or people some breathing room. Um, I, I always, um, I've pulled out the card of hope. Um, and, and, and what this is meaning for me is that um, you'll find that if you um, look on the side of optimism and um, have a positive reaction to it or take a positive reaction from it instead of leaving that negative taste in your mouth you'll find that um it will help with this this situation to come around um and this negative situation will turn into a positive one um I, i'm finding as well that like i need to tell you to reach into yourself into your spiritual sanctuary um, within your uh, your heart, um, you'll find that your um, by doing that you'll achieve, or by looking within yourself, you'll be able to bring out that inner peace within you um, and succumb yourself to joy um, and, and uh, positivity. You you'll find that. Um, you know, that everything is possible. That's what I need to tell you. Anything is possible. So when things are looking like um, they're going to only go one way, anything can happen to change that situation. And so it's all possible. Um, this is all I'm getting for you. Uh, Paul now is going to see what he can get for you in his, and then we'll get your feedback after that. Paul. <laughs> yes, I, uh, I, I just, I just wondered what would happen. But let's see what we can get for you, then, Jacqueline. Let's see what we can get for you. <clears throat> Come on, righty, all right. <clears throat> Well, what I'm getting with yourself is it, it's something that a lot of people don't need in life, okay? there's It's like somebody's very tense. Oh, hello. <laughs> Someone's very... Hang on. Yeah, you need to change direction. The direction that you've been in so far in life hasn't taken you to where you need to be, okay? The people around you are supposed to be helping, but they seem, some of them seem to want to take things in the wrong direction. And then those people that are willing to understand and take things somewhere where it should go are all a collective. But there's no, there's no going back until certain things are resolved. Things need to be taken to... The next level because 
somebody needs to understand that the the wording that is being used at the moment isn't correct. The correct wording will find its way out, but everybody has to be on the same page to, to help this be resolved. There's too much anger. The anger is not a good thing because it's like somebody starts to clear the, the wounds and then somebody comes in and changes it again and go it goes backwards so that person when these things are happening need to be out of either the room or out of the situation for a very long time for a while but you've also got to look forward to beyond that you've got to make sure that when um things are resolved that everybody has a purpose okay that everybody has a purpose on their journey it's like somebody you know you always get these people it's like people just want to take what other people have and rip it up because they don't understand what their what life is and what they're going through they just want to just to, to destroy it okay <clears throat> but there seems to be something to do with i keep getting something to do with work as well it, it just seems if this isn't <coughs> to do with work then then it's like a family matter but somebody has to work something out at work okay and the work side needs to be sorted out also it um so it's like this someone's got a balance someone has to balance life and work yeah but the progress in life and his journey and your work and family and everything that belongs around you you know it needs to be worked out because there's a lot of doubt in people's minds on certain things okay um and if people don't suddenly start to uh understand these things you know that's where it's going to head it's going to be so much doubt every time certain people are talking to certain people you know it's going to be Oh, why did they say that? Why did they say that? Why did they? And it's just going to continue. There's also somebody who's been standing next to you uh, from the spirit world that's trying to try. It's like a matriarch type person that wants to um, say their piece as well, but they can see it from a different point of view and they want this to stop. The words are, we want this to stop now it has to stop yeah but there's also documentation that needs to be looked at as well okay there needs to be some documentation looked at because that documentation needs to be sorted ASAP because that that will resolve uh, certain aspects of, of what's going on and it mm it will start to calm people down as well. Nobody is wrong. It's just the way it's being said. It's just like people are, are just mixing their words up, words up and they're making mountains out of molehills. Okay? But you've also got to view it from a different point of view. You've got to view it from different angles as well. So you've got to look at it from every point of view and no nobody's wrong nobody's wrong 
like I say, everybody has a different point of view. Okay, but don't give up. Don't give up on life. Don't give up on your journey. Don't let people control who you are. Don't let people control your life, your journey. And don't let them control other people around you too. If it's just one person, then that one person needs to be either ostracized or just, you know, take them out of, you know, take them out of your life. But there's also, uh, you need to be calm as well. So get out, get outside and relax. Get out into the sunshine. Get out into the, when the sunshine, sun shines, just get out into nature. Just enjoy it. Just enjoy that wonderfulness that, and it'll calm you down. It'll ground you. It'll ground you and you'll notice some things change as well. But there's also going to be some other people that come in that have been through this before and they will try and guide you through. I, I, it feels like, a, I don't know why, but I'm getting lawyer with this. I don't know why I'm getting this. But it just feels like someone that has a shirt and tie and lawyer type person that will guide you and it will make you smile again. Yeah. But I'm going to leave that one with you. And uh, whew, I hope that resonated with yourself, Jacqueline. And uh, yeah, thank you for letting us do that reading for you. I thank you. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. You hit the nail on the head, really. Amazing. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. Oh. We're just listening oh. to you. We're listening. I'm listening and we're talking to myself. <laughs> no, no, we're just listening to you. I do that Paul's a lot, normally, but, you know. He's normally, yeah, Paul's normally the one that talks to himself. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. There is a lot going on at the moment, a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. But uh, you don't have to divulge that. But I think we didn't do it anyway. <laughs> you said a lot. <laughs> wow. Yeah. But, you can um, always you can always play go because this will be on my page, so you can always yeah. play back and re-listen. And you may yeah. not have noticed it. It's probably because I, I know Paul very, very well. Paul was actually channeling, so spirit was really talking through him. Um, and I, I can notice the difference when he does that. So he was actually doing that um, with yours. Yeah. I, I noticed. You don't know who the spirit was because there's a few. No, no, no. The, it, it's, it's not just. It's normally my spirit guide that, right. that does the. Um, yeah, if, if someone does want to come through, they'll, then they'll do that reading through me. But it was just my spirit guides this time. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, so was it both myself and Sylvana? Um, yes. Getting getting it spot on there. Yes. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. We we try our best, and you know, um, but it, it, it's nice when when because we had that little laugh as well. It brought the energies to that right level. Yeah. So it was easier to work as well. Yeah. But uh, no, we're, we're grateful that we, we could do that. But like Sylvana said, you know, go go through go through it um, again. And um, if you have to, just leave us a message on either Sylvana's page or on my page, yep. Psychic Coach, and let us know that way. Um, I will because then, then then people don't have to hear what uh, what yeah. you, what you've said. Yeah, you know. Uh, but you know, we're, we're so grateful that you came on. 
that you what what you it was meant to be to every person that gets a reading is well that's it yeah because i went off for like a minute or two and then when i got back on you called my name and i looked at my son i'm like oh my gosh oh my gosh yes so it was meant to be (laughs) yeah definitely yeah definitely but uh well we're gonna let you go Yes, thank you for coming on and giving us uh, an opportunity to do that reading for you. Uh, There's been some lovely comments um, that have been coming through, but um, even Courtney saying that that was an awesome reading. Um, But, yeah, no, thank you so much for joining us um, on here, Jacqueline, and very good of you to come on the live too. We had three on today on the live. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I only did it because my son told me to. He, he goes, go good, on, Mum. Good on him. <laughs> so, yeah. Good on him. No, but, but you, you feel more enlightened now that you've... I do. You've, but, but that's it. It's just like a... It's also a... Uh, it, it takes you out of that comfort zone. Totally. It, it takes you out of the comfort zone and it just basically says... Yeah, you, you can, you know, you can do it. You can come on live whenever you feel like it now. <laughs> I don't even like getting my photo taken and look at this. It's like, wow. Wow. There you go. There yeah. You go. <laughs> uh, you'll, well, you'll, 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 be having, you'll be having so many photos taken now. <laughs> yeah, maybe not, but okay. Yeah. 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 No, yeah. thank you, guys. A big kiss for you. And um, yeah, we'll see you come. Come on, like you know, even in uh, joining in the, the chats and everything when yeah. we do yeah. the lives. Yeah, definitely. But thank you totally. for letting us read you. And yeah, yeah. Like I say, just leave it in the comments for it, or not in the comments, but in our either on Savannah, Savannah's page or or mine, yeah. um, and just let us know uh, in that way because uh, yeah, f- from the way you. You're speaking. It, it, it's a bit too much for the people here. Yeah, yeah. definitely. But uh, but you have a great night's sleep. I will. I will now. Yes. Yeah. And, wow. and and just enjoy life. Keep going. Enjoy the journey. Yes. And, uh, <laughs> and keep smiling. Yes. Make sure you yeah. smile. And don't forget to put your teeth in next time. What? <laughs> no, it's a running joke, Jacqueline, because people say they won't come on because they haven't got their teeth in. <laughs> well, I did reply to that and I said I don't have any teeth and as well, so, yeah. No, that's where I got it from. That's where I got ah, it from. Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay, we'll see ah. you, Jacqueline. Yeah, see you take you. care. And say hello to your son who's sitting next yeah. to you. Yeah. yeah. Bye. Uh, <laughs> hello. <laughs> you take yeah, care. Too. Bye, see guys. You. Bye. See you later. Bye. Bye. Oh, Beautiful what lady. a lovely lady. Yeah. Oh, look, we saw her son as well. <laughs> Good on him for making her go live. See, and I bet you now she's glad that she did. Yeah. So some people, you know, you just have to nudge them over the edge. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Even Susan uh, put in the comment. Um, did you know it, it's so worth coming on and talking? I think you get you. you it, the reading is more worthwhile because we have that interaction, or you have mm. the interaction with us, and we can talk. Sometimes through the the comments, the translation of it doesn't come across. Yeah. <laughs> no, but that, that's, that, but it, it is good. It, it's um, like we've said, we've seen people's faces go from down here, you know, like to hey, <laughs> you know. <laughs> no, but no, but it is. It, we've seen people's faces go. Yeah, go yeah, from, yeah from really down into so happy, you know, yeah. just because we've said some wonderful words or they've been on, on the live because they know that other people are also um <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Courtney, you're naughty. Yes. Did you, <laughs> but you I see like she wrote? Did, did you see where she wrote? She said, ooh, her son is looking nice. Yeah, his his son looked nice. I don't know. I didn't look. It's not my it's not my thing. <laughs> But, you know, it's been fantastic um, in this live. And you should see what people were saying about you earlier on, Paul. Um, no, really not, no, really nice things, uh, you know. Um, I'm just trying to find them back here. Um, because, uh, you know, a few of them noticed that you were channeling. And, oh. um, you know, even Andrew was saying that, you know, you're really good and you have a big heart and... Um, I can't find the comments here, but um, I'm sure we'll see them. Um, no, but everybody has a gift yeah. inside them. It's just how you bring it out. Yeah, it, it's. Um, Diana was saying it was really beautiful to watch you connect, and um, uh, Andrew said that you're a great guy with a big heart. Courtney was saying it was amazing. And um, Deanna was saying that she, she knew you had a big heart when you first when she first watched our live. Mm. Um, no. Yeah, so no. and then I got some nice no. comments. <laughs> it was so nice. Oh, <laughs> My face good. is going red. <laughs> mm. But thank you so much for everyone that's come on and joined us. Uh, it's been great, and, and I, I've really enjoyed it, uh, the people coming on, doing it, and everyone that's been interacting in the comments, it, it's fantastic to see, like, everyone talking to each other. Um, you know, I, unfortunately, like, um, I know Paul has been totally drained now, and um, my mm. energy has just gone down as well. But um, we're going to be back on Thursday. Uh, the same time that we came on today. So, but we'll be on Paul page. The um, oh, Paul page. Paul's page. No. The, psychic <laughs> um, the psychic touch. The psychic touch. So um, we'll be like, but I'll copy the link on here as well. But Paul, did you want to say anything before we go? Yep. No, thank you to you all uh, for um, being there for us today especially Courtney. She's been here since the start. You yeah. Know, we're sorry we didn't pull you out the, out the bowl, but it wasn't your turn today. We, um, If it had been, you would have been in there somewhere. Um, but, yeah, you're a wonderful person anyway. And if when you next come on, we, you know, who says it might be your turn, you know? Um, but that's the same for everybody. You know, it might be your turn whenever you turn up. But it's we... like Jacqueline. Jacqueline was off and she came back on just as we called her name. So yeah. that in itself, like it was meant to be. Yeah. Um, but, she, she, you know, everybody, as we say, is our family. And we, we, we actually miss, if we, could, if we could, we'd do shows seven days a week. But we've yeah. been really knackered. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, you know, because we have other commitments, we 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 can only do the days that we do. Um, but you know, share us out there, get us out there to other people. You've seen what we can do. Um, you know, and and people, you lot have a laugh with us as well. And um, we just want as many people as we can to to interact with us yeah um you know and we just want people to enjoy 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 it as much as what you like do um but massive massive thank yous to you all thank you and have a you're fantastic welcome, night Tisha. day afternoon whatever you're having have a great one yeah and thank you tisha and everybody for all these wonderful comments. No, Thank Courtney, you. You, you're not unreadable. It's just that when, like, what happens is that when when your time comes to, to know or a message needs to be given to you, it'll happen. It just happens. 
So yeah. don't think don't think that. Um, no, be yeah. Because we've actually had people come on and they've been here over and over again, and they're going read. Can, am I going to get a reading? Am I going to go? And we go. No, it's not just not your turn. You know, if it was, then we'd have done the reading, and then that person then maybe gets two readings in a row because yeah. they get half a reading and then they get the rest of the reading on the next day or the next show. Yeah, and then they won't have another reading for six months. But it, it, that's just the way it works. Um, yeah, but, uh, you know, um, but y y you'll get one. Don't you worry. You will get one. <laughs> um, yeah, don't believe that, Courtney. Um, yeah, because that's like manifesting itself inside yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, because you were told that, you actually make it happen. So don't yeah. don't think like that. Yeah, you you you'll get you'll get a reading. If it's not from us, it'll be from somebody. Yeah, and you um you will you will in, you'll enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah. That's what. Oh, she's writing. I think she means bollocks. She's saying like it's not right that what is unreadable. It's not true. Yeah. No, I think she's saying that's bollock. <laughs> that's rude. That's a rude language in our country. <laughs> yeah. Uh, don't 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 think about what you got from that reading, Courtney, because it, it doesn't sound very good and you'll find if you think like that you, you will make it that happen mm -hmm. um and it's not a, a good cloud to have over you no no but yeah. you, you'll you'll find a way uh one day that that it, it's it's waiting it's in the queue i, I can actually see it <laughs> you're actually in the queue yeah you're actually in the queue so you know but you know Everybody have a fantastic day. Have a yes, fantastic and night and night and night. It's almost night here. <laughs> and afternoon. Yes. And wherever but, you are, enjoy yeah. the sun, the dark, or whatever. <laughs> yeah, the night time. Um, oh, did you, Courtney? Come on on Thursday when we do it on Thursday. Because if if we if we do it, because um, sometimes we we actually. Do like a where people come on at the end. Yeah, sometimes uh, maybe we'll do it this Thursday. We actually let people come on with us, a whole group of people. Mm. But at the moment, I'm just having trouble keeping my eyes open. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But um, okay. But thank you so much, everyone, for joining us. Mm -hmm. A big hug to everybody. And um, hopefully we meet you guys again that you come back on next time. Uh, uh, well, so we're on Thursday, but um, yep. see everyone. Yeah, you, you sleep well wherever you're from.